<laughs> Hello, good morning, good afternoon. Hope everyone's doing well today. I need to fix my camera brightness, so let me do that really quick. Might as well, okay. Let me fix my camera real quick and then we will explain what we're doing today. Also, does everything sound good? Do I sound good when compared to the music? Sounds good? Okay, cool. I forgot to post to... <laughs> I have a new tweet. Go like it, go like it. That way everybody knows that I'm live. I forgot to post to IG, so hold. Okay, I'm not stalling. I promise I'm not stalling. <laughs> Unless... Because <laughs> not to say that I was doing everything last minute, but I might have. I still haven't worn my hair down in a long time. Okay, it's posted. It's up. So, today. You know, San is very busy. He has a lot of kids he's got to visit. And adults. And adults. So he enlisted in my help in determining whoever in my chat is getting onto the naughty or nice list. So how today is going to work is last night I spent two hours going through our follower calligraphy journal to see which followers chatted and which did not. So I went through the whole journal and then this journal, right? <clears throat> and then I also found out which followers unfollowed. He said to guess, but it's fine. No beef. Unless. So they're automatically naughty chatters. If you unfollow, you're a bad chatter. <laughs> so I wrote down everybody who has chatted even one time in my chat room, minus the people who got banned, i.e., like chatbots or sus chatters. So, out of my 600 plus follower count, 185 people chatted. So about a third of my follower count is coming to the stream and chatted. Granted, maybe the other 400 have lurked at some point. You know what that means? Lurkers are always good viewers. They are always good, so lurkers are guaranteed on the nice list, okay? Welcome in, Giorgio. Welcome in, Hacker. Also, check out the pin message if you're coming in, just to get a brief explanation. So, <clears throat> I wrote some names down for the substitute. Yeah, so chatters throughout the stream, how it's gonna work is I... These are all my first followers. Yana was my first ever follower. So, I wrote down everybody's name, and then I assigned every name a number based on when they followed. So, 1 through 185, I have a random number generator. That way, everybody has a fair chance of being read. Hopefully, we can get through all 180 today. If not, you can always skip the line. If you're in chat now and you don't have time later, you can use your channel points and skip the line and have your logs reviewed and read first. We already had one person redeemed, so we're going to be doing crystal first today. Um, yeah. So that, that's what we're doing. We're going to be going through logs, and then at the end of stream, we will be reviewing the answers for the Naughty or Nice quiz. So if you haven't already, exclam- oh wait, I didn't change the command. Fuck. Exclamation survey! Oopsie, let me update the command. <laughs> okay, I need to fix that. I, I didn't change the keyword to quiz as well. Look, dude, my computer's fucking bright. Thank you for redeeming next. We will do you next. If you haven't filled out the survey, please make sure you do so before the end of stream. Preferably now. That'd be great. Let's see, did it work? Okay, it works. Okay, exclamation quiz. Okay. So, I think we can go ahead and get started. I'm drinking canned bubble tea. It's kind of ass. But you know what? It works. Okay, I need to get, like... I'm, gonna, I'm not listening to the music, because it's going to distract me. 
So, on our second camera, wait, I need to, just so you can, guys can see what it'll look like. I'm going to be doing a lot of typing, so it's going to be um, computer ASMR. Okay, so how it's going to look like. I will pull up the chatter's logs. We will review how long they've been following, how long they've been sub for, and then we will see if they have any timeouts, any bans, or any mod comments, and then how many messages they have in chat. Um, I also have an actual list because as we go through today, we will we'll be writing all the good chatters in black and then all the naughty chatters in red. The logs? Yeah, we're going through logs. We're going through logs. Okay. So, throughout the stream, <clears throat> ain't no way! Thank you for that Reese of five months. Thank you, Hacker. I appreciate you. You're gonna get your name written at the end of the stream. Okay. What was I saying? Well, there was one more thing I wanted to say. Yeah, can we get some whackers? <laughs> Dude, there's one more thing I want to- Oh yeah, as we go through, as you can see up here, vote in chat. It's vote Y-E-A or vote N-A-Y. So it'll look like that in the chat. So if you think somebody's a good chatter, put vote yeah. If somebody's a bad chatter, put vote nay. Because we're not going to be doing polls because I think that's too much, but just so you guys can feel like you have some input. You know, you guys are my jury. Not everybody's going to be a good chatter, okay? Are we ready? Are we ready? Okay. I'll just, I'll just use my drink and hope I don't knock it down. <laughs> Why is my heart racing? Okay. So first... And if you don't know how to look at logs and you stream yourself, you just put slash command user space and then their username. So first, we had somebody skip the line, so we had Dino Crystal two zero. Our first log of the day. Okay. We also have to look at account creation date. Because if we go back to mine, I created my account in 2020, but I technically had an account that I have no idea what the username is that I made in like 2019 or 2018 because that's when I was watching somebody who just streamed their podcast on Twitch. But my new account, the one that I streamed from now, is from 2020. Okay, so ideally, I wish I could scroll to the top to see what they were like at the very beginning. But all the people who have 999 plus messages, you guys are crazy. You guys are actual fucking simps. So we're gonna scroll up as much as I can. Look, November, following since June. I think Crystal has been chatting for a while. Cause Twitch, <laughs> dude, all these, huh, huh, dude, what the fuck, dude. And then Emmy emotes, okay, good chatter. It's so fun, I'm not good at dancing. I just learned the chorus part. <laughs> okay, we're gonna be skimming if they have a lot. There's some chatters who have one message, some people have over a thousand. So we're gonna be skipping through to see if there's anything juicy. 10 out of 10? Wait, no way. No way. Right here, 10 out of 10 for an ad break? You're lying. You never give me that good ratings. <laughs> it's funny, Crystal will be like, no, all the time. It's so good. Oh, this is from the tournament because we were talking about how the track glitch. Okay, nothing weird yet. I feel like for most chatters, everyone starts off wholesome, and then after like a month or two, they get more trolly or jokey, and then usually, this hasn't happened a lot in my chat, but like month four to six, that's when they become like fucking weird simps. Thankfully, everybody's wholesome. What do you guys think? Do you guys think Crystal is good or bad? Vote yay or vote nay. I hate this song, Negativity, that's not good. That's not very good. <laughs> Wait, right here, right here. I'm not that mean. You calling me a weirdo? Oh my god, we're important to you. Wow, skull emoji. <laughs> Hi, Ed, welcome in. <laughs> oh, you changed your username, Ed. Because, like, I had yours written down, but I didn't realize it was two underscores. 
I'll add you down. Because I had to make sure that everybody's usernames were spelled correctly. Because, ha like, I lost, like, nearly 100 followers total. Because either they were, like, bot accounts or, um... Or, like, people changed their usernames. So I'm glad I found Ed's. <laughs> Republicans just like hearing themselves? Political Andy? Uh-oh. Why do we get political during Animal Crossing streams? Uh-oh. No furs, no politics. Okay, I think Crystal... <laughs> Wait, sorry. I, I accidentally put my finger over the ban button, which I cropped out here. <laughs> Imagine. Okay. Crystal? Good chatter. Nothing crazy. Pretty tame. Nothing bad. Okay, this is so awkward, right? So first chatter of the day. We have Crystal. Thank you for redeeming Batty. Welcome in, hon. What are mod comments? So mod comments are basically, um, if you're, if you're mod, you can, like, put little notes. Like, for example, if um, Potato's being weird one day in, like, offline Discord chat. Because Discord is separate from Twitch chat, right? So I can go into the chatter's logs and be like, oh, hey, Potato was kind of weird in Discord. Keep an eye on them. It's kind of like only moderators and streamers can see the comments. So it's just kind of like... It's like little uh, sticky notes you can put on people's profiles that only the mods in your channel can see. Thank you for redeeming Petita. Okay, next. We have Nyx. Now, Nyx is an interesting case. Because some chatters I was thinking about last night, I was like, who is possibly a naughty chatter? And I think Nyx might be one of them. Because, you know the whole controversy with trauma dumping because whenever Nyx comes in they always have an opener and it's always usually something like oh my god this happened oh no so that's usually what they start off with and that's fine that's fine but <laughs> wait it's funny because like Nyx also types in all caps all the time it's fucking hilarious I love chatters like this 900 plus messages following since April 27th, so right after my birthday. Tier 1 primer for 7 months, Ayo. <laughs> okay, I'm trying to find... Oh, this is when their apartment got flooded? Sag? Wait, right here, what the fuck? November 3rd, I'm in your walls. That's kind of weird. I don't like that. I don't like that. I don't like that. Okay, let's scroll up a little bit, because this is still November. Okay, emote spam? <laughs> what the fuck is this? Oh, I must- okay. You know how when I go to the bathroom, I tell you guys to spam? That's probably what it is. <laughs> okay. I'm trying to find a part where, like, Nyx comes in with a banger. Oh, uh, we were talking about socialism? Hello. Damn, Nyx was, like, chatting up a storm this day. Because you can see, like, the, the time of day, and then also, like, the actual date. <laughs> we don't like you, Kev Dog. That's not very nice. Uh-oh. Over here. <laughs> October 18th. I feel like a rabbit cat that you're trying to give a bath today. What the fuck does that mean? Uh, and, okay, you know what is nice? I love when chatters say hi to each other because it makes it seem like you guys are excited to see each other and that's honestly adorable. Camera still bro? Sad. Add question mark? Okay, what do you guys think? Do you guys think Nyx is good or bad? Wait, <laughs> Nyx story time. I grew up on a handed down N64 that was in Japanese form. Our landlord's son can teach us English in Japan. Okay, I thought that was going to be something weird, but that was honestly cute. Cute. <gasps> we have a nay? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Wait, what is this? <gasps> Held a message 
for number six base terms. I can't, it's not safe for work. Lol. What were we talking about? Uh oh. Uh oh, we stumbled upon an auto mod message. It's not often you guys get auto modded besides cursing. Wait, no! The message right before. I almost said a bad joke. This is safe for work chat. Hello, y'all. How are you? Uh oh. Oh no. The next chatter to vote will decide Nyx's fate. Next chatter to vote. I don't know. I'm on the fence. Nyx is wholesome, but also they've gotten out about it many times. Nay? Oh! Chat has decided Nyx is a naughty chatter. Mm mm. Now, also, I would like to clarify this is just for fun. Please don't get mad. Like, I've, I, I've explicitly explained before that, um, what you call it? Uh, what you call it? Um, that if anybody is genuinely not a good person in chat, then they will get clapped. Anybody who is in chat is always going to be good, and if they're bad, they get banned. <laughs> this is to reason. You know, you gotta stuff the ballot boxes. <laughs> okay, we're having fun, we're having fun. Oh, wait, you know what I forgot to put? I forgot to put lurkers. Lurkers are always good. Because, you know, they don't need to be entertained. They're there to vibe. They don't need your attention. So lurkers are always good chatters. Or always good viewers, rather. Lurkers are good. Let me fix the camera. There we go. Okay, next. <laughs> next we have Mac. Mac is interesting. Because I think Mac has skirted the lines a few times. Not Mac Zero. Account created 2020, following since April 23rd, right before my birthday, but motherfucker did not show up for the birthday stream. I think that's very mean. You followed right before, dude. Yeah, Mac has one time of- Interesting you point that out. Does anybody remember how Mac got this time out? Because I remember, um, one of my friends was, like, actually watching the stream when it happened, and they were like, why did Mac delete- messages get deleted? I was like, oh, well, they asked for it, and I timed them out for a second. Yeah. It gets cool because when you click on it, it tells them when it was and then how long. Oh, I timed you up for a minute. <laughs> Hi, Kaboba, welcome in. <laughs> Little man, I thought I timed you up for a second. During the Splatoon stream? Now we got two people got timed out during the Splatoon stream. Little man. Hmm, so keep in mind, chatters. So please, as we go through, put your votes in, okay? Put your little yays or nays in chat throughout. Like, don't wait till the end, because I need to, like, have myself convinced throughout. Lamau, Luigi, yeah, we'll get there. Now, Mac, sub for eight months, sub the whole time they've been watching. Good chatter. And a primer. We love primers. I wish I could scroll up, or it'd be cool if they had like a search bar to where you could see like a specific date. Like, I would love to see people's first messages. Now, what is interesting about Mac is that they have definitely skirted the lines of being a very parasocial viewer. But, they always respect that line. And Mac is always an offline chat. So, that's why they have so many fucking messages. And they email spam all the time. <laughs> wait, wait, I saw this one. Well, you don't eat them, they are hard. I thought that was it, and it's like, as a rock. I was like, oh, phew, save. <laughs> save. Okay, I want to scroll up to, like, as far as I can go. We're still in December, because Mac is here, like, every day. Don't be spamming loves, that will not help you. That will not help you. Gage. <laughs> I don't know if I can even- Look, my, my computer's like lagging. Because it's not letting me scroll up enough. What would- Okay. What constitutes a good chatter though? Because to me, I, I think my favorite chat style 
Not to do favorites is bad. Batty's my favorite, like, chatter. Because I like, because Batty chats how I chat myself. I always bring up Batty because they're, like, the best chatter. But Mac, they talk about themselves a lot. But I also ask you guys questions to where you should talk about yourself. I'm excited for holiday streams. We love support. We love that. We love the chatters who love ads. <laughs> Gage vegetarian though, I missed it. I think Mac skirts the line, but I don't think they've done anything outlandish. You know why? Because I was editing a VOD from, I think it was May, and Mac said something that was kind of like jokey, but could have been construed as mean. And then they walked it back and they were like, oh my god, I'm sorry. And I was like, oh, Mac is a good chat. That was good. Okay, Mac, another good chatter. Gentle reminder, if you're just coming in, we're going to be looking at chatter's logs. It will be in randomized order, but for now. If you want to skip the line and have me read your logs first, you can use your channel points. This is going to take all day. <laughs> If we're spending like three minutes per. There we go. Next in line, we have Batty. We were just talking about Batty. I'm gonna be honest, I wish Batty was in chat more. I really do, but you're in the UK, so I, I can kind of forgive you. 900 plus messages sub for seven months, falling since February. I think February is when my channel first started to really grow. And then I had my peak in like June, July. <laughs> we are here to sacrifice, no? <laughs> Wait, auto mod- Okay, how- how my chat works is, um, I never see the auto modded messages because it automatically deletes it from my screen, so I just never see them. What the fuck? What character keeps doing that Looney Tunes scream, Lamau? Held for bullying. What? 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 <laughs> Meg binoculars can't see it, dude. It's so good. That that is my favorite. Cause look, you, you guys can't see it because since the um third party emotes are an extension, they don't show up in this like Twitch part of mod view. I wish it did. <clears throat> People scared. This says a lot about society. 4318. Wait, what is that? What was that? Oh, that was- this was when we were playing the scary game. That was probably like a door code or something. Yeah, cause like, I have the strictest auto mod- <laughs> I have the strictest auto mod settings just to be extra safe. <laughs> Say bazinga, batches. <laughs> I can't. Oh my god, I can't. Dies of cringe, literally. Dude, Batty's my favorite. I can't. It, it's funny, like, reading back logs or watching back streams because I can, like, look at a clip or see a chat message and remember what we were doing that day. Cuphead stream Prage. I'm never doing fucking Cuphead. I will only play Cuphead if my sister buys the game. Bad chess, same, but for real. <laughs> Speed running to 999 plus. People run cry. Oh, I feel like I've sent the message like 10 times. Don't check my logs. Don't check my logs! Awkward. Well, you're already at over 900, so... Squid game bad chest? Okay, I'm gonna scroll up as far as I can go. Wait, we're already in September. I wanna see when Batty... Okay, because Batty doesn't come to stream often, so maybe we can actually get to the start. This May... Be crossing these animals. <laughs> Wait. Gone wrong, police called Batches. This was when we were trying to think, because sometimes when we do Animal Crossing, I'll be like, guys, what should we name the stream? Ooh, April? Wait, I think we can actually get to the very beginning. Schedule, smile, banger, catch up, nodders. Flowers are extinct in London. Wait, we're almost at it. We're almost at it. Oh, right here, right here. Hello? He him, you can call me just Batty. Sash, my computer broke, otherwise I'd be there. 
Yeah, I'm messing up emotes on mobile. For real, Twitch, go on, get on that, please. Yeah, can't lose points if you don't vote. Easy. Omegalon. You should check out 7TV, too. You got, like, 750 email subs. Oh, my God. Did I not have 7TV back then? Fifth, pretty sure. Okay, fourth. Good take. I love fork knife. Bat chest. Twitch has ruined my vocabulary. See? Hmm. Batty was good from the start. Batty was a good chatter from the start. I think... I didn't see any nays in chat, either. I think Batty is good chatter. Good chatter. Okay. Right now, we only have one more person in line, and then we're gonna go to randomized numbers. So if you want to skip the line and have me look at your logs while you're in chat now, use your channel points. <clears throat> Thank you for redeeming, Hacker. You'll be next. I want to see lemons. Yeah, lemons is probably crazy. <laughs> okay, next we have potato. Oh. What? Oh, you have two underscores, because that's your alt, I think, right? Oopsie. There we go. There we go. Okay, 999 plus messages, zero timeout, zero bans. Very nice. Following since June, so Potato started following in the peak. You seem to be doing great. They look good. Thank you. I love encouragement. She called me cute? Uh-oh. See, I'm telling you guys, that four to six month mark, and that's when they start changing. Following since June? December is the six month mark. Uh-oh. 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 <laughs> Screw Mac? Is that trash talk? Uh-oh. Oh no. That's not very nice. I started being weird beforehand. <laughs> You know what's nice? Potato's usually a lurker. Lurkers are good. I don't tolerate Max Slander. Oh no, there's so many nays. Uh-oh. <laughs> Wait, bye, and then hi, two hours later, Lamau. <laughs> Automods also said my message wasn't sent. I wish there was like a separate section to tell me how many automated messages there were. That'd go crazy. Nay, only because Potato marked me as naughty. Ooh, there's some infighting now. What was the Autobot? Right here. Oatmeal cream pies. <laughs> so many of you guys got caught for that. <laughs> Wait, sorry. Oatmeal cream pies. Oatmeal cream hyphen pies. <laughs> oh, that was so good. So many of you guys got clapped for that. <laughs> Binge eating is fun and tasty. That's toxic. Okay, let's, let's scroll up a little bit. Imagine John dies. That'd be sad. Yeah, I totally agree. That's why I like, I'm glad my automata is stricter. <clears throat> it's black. Huh? Obviously that's a that's a misspell, but that's a very bad misspell. Oh no. We're gonna keep scrolling past that. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Holy No one tells me what not to say. You love somebody who stands up for themselves. And is beside me. That is true, that is true. Good defense. $30 tip for you. Hey yo, that was when I think when they cheered a lot. No, never mind. <clears throat> <laughs> Who
Who here celebrates Thanksgiving for the real thing? What do you mean by that? Explain. The genocide? Huh? Don't be shy, chat. Peace I to smile. <laughs> uh, out of context? <laughs> Potatoes messages can be bad. <laughs> yeah, I saw this Nookie message too. Okay, I'm gonna keep scrolling to see. If you're following me since June. I go to bed around 2 a.m. Dude, you need to go to bed earlier. Wait, August? August? Because I, I think Potato started, like, avidly watching in the beginning of fall time. If not the very end of summer. Stream cancelled. All in. Sad. Okay, we're at the beginning of August. <clears throat> okay, what do you guys think? Final votes. Final votes. What do you guys think? Wait, we found their first message. No way. <clears throat> I found it. Yeah, like, I was right. They've only really been, like, super active in chat during, like, fall time. First message, June 30th. Following since June 30th as well. I always get sussed out whenever I have somebody follow the same day and type in chat. I'm always worried that they're, like, bad people. So I'm always super sussed. Anyway. First message, 12.30 p.m. <clears throat> Hello, finally made it to this chat. I haven't really seen gameplay of Animal Crossing. How would you describe the game? For me, the youngest being the young- Wait, for me, youngest- Or being the youngest was the worst. XD type lag. It's very fun opening up Pokemon packs. I, I make sure to keep card savers near for better protection. Good. It doesn't feel like two hours. I believe you'll get her. Oh no, an Aurora hunting stream is your first dream. Oh no. Oh, yeah, because you were watching on mobile, and I was like, yeah, watch on desktop. Desktop is better. Okay, cool. I think Potato's good. I think Potato's good. I think similar to Mac, you talk about yourself a lot, but that's fine. You know, that's how most people can interact and engage with the stream. But yeah, pretty solid. I think Potato's good chatter. Good chatter. Also, they've cheered a lot of bits, so, you know, that does help. <laughs> Giving money to streamer does help. I promise you there will be more naughty chatters. I saw a few because when I was looking up who has typed in the chat, I was able to see their logs last night as well. So I saw a few naughty chatters. So don't you worry. Next, you're fine. It's not just you. It's not going to be just you. <laughs> oh, wow. <well. clears throat> I think it's honestly like a power move to be determined naughty, you know? I have a naughty chatter in mind. Uh oh. I love you all parasocially, of course. Parasocially. Okay, next person in line. We have Hacker. We have nobody else in line past Hacker, so if you want to redeem now, redeem now. <clears throat> okay, hi, Hacker. Account created 2022 following since April. I always get sussed out. Whenever I get a new follower during a stream, I check to see when their account was made and then how long they've been following, right? So when I see somebody have a new account and then follow somewhat recently, I'm always kind of scared. Because usually they're bot accounts, but Hacker, I knew Hacker from like TikTok. Um, because I remember they would comment on my stuff occasionally and this was, I think he followed right before the tournament. Hacker said some scary stuff. No, Hacker's usually pretty good. Yeah, fart. <laughs> I got automatic because I said my phone died. <laughs> I don't, hackers are usually pretty good. And hackers are nice because they usually come in right at the start of stream. And I love when chatters come right away because I like like saying hi to everybody. <clears throat> what were we doing here? Yay or nay? When was this? Literally, wait, this is today. <laughs> what? <laughs> Why'd you put fart today on like the day when we're looking at logs? <laughs> Uh, <clears throat> uh, and the hacker has the meta. Now, for the past few streams, they'll just say, like, a word from the title. It's so, like, decorate, cookie. So many cake pops in reference to the cake pop stream. 
Did you glue peach to the tree? No, this- You know what Hacker does all the time that is actually so bad, so naughty? Your Pikachu fell. Your Pikachu fell. Let's see how many times they've said that. So one. I'm skimming through everything to see when and how many times they've said, has your Pikachu fallen? I'm a fake piece in underscore 17 fan? Literally self-reporting. <clears throat> Wowie, I totally don't know what we're doing today. Behind you. That's another thing. Where is it? Where? Is it? Right here. Behind you? Do not say shit like that. Hackers fine, because they've been here since fucking April. But any of you motherfuckers do that? Don't do that shit. I was watching some of um, the clips from, like, um, Nim's Best of 2022 stuff, and there were so many clips where, like, people would point out stuff behind them moving as they're streaming. That's scary. <clears throat> Three thousand seven hundred sixty-eight messages sent in your channel. No way. I mean, it's over a thousand, so it could be actually. I'm in your walls, guys. Don't, don't. Hey, why, why'd you type just a? Hey. You, you type the random as shit sometimes. Also, you're watching without video. Kind of cringe. A Tuesday. <laughs> Okay, you haven't said your Pikachu fell for like a week, and that's pretty good. Cause you just used to say like every day. Do not make I'm in your walls with Chamada. Please don't. Please don't. Please don't. I can see my Pikachu in my viewfinder, so. <clears throat> Wait, chatters, we are 45 minutes into stream, so I'm late. It's time for me to tell you if you're new here, follow the channel. You get cool emotes, and you get to type a chat. Wow. <clears throat> Bought a whole laptop. Peace I too rich. Pikachu fell? Ooh, three offenses calling me rich and my Pikachu fell. That's two. If we find one more bad thing, I think Hacker might be a naughty chatter. If I see one more thing out of line... <clears throat> Your Pikachu fell. That's another one. It's another one. Yeah, I, I'm, I've seen some that I've skipped. <laughs> Ketchup hater points to their self. <laughs> I think Hacker might be a naughty ch Oh, but they do RP. It it's so funny. Like, Lemon will RP with Hacker and Max sometimes, and it's so cute. New PB. I have notifications on for three people on Twitch. I just don't like the notifications that make your phone vibrate. Okay, Hacker. The one thing that will redeem yourself, am I on your Twitch notifications? Am I one of those three? Hacker does clip the stream sometimes, which is very good. Yes? Okay, you're saved. You're redeemed. <laughs> of course. Good. Okay, you're saved. You were very close, but you're saved. I think Hacker is my longest regular chatter. Because I feel like most active chatters now came during summer, but Hacker came before. There we go. That's how we get an early true. True. <laughs> Lying. <laughs> Okay, chatters, anybody else want to skip the line? Anybody who's in chat, you want to skip the line? Otherwise, we're going to do random. And you might have to wait all stream. If you want to skip, you can use your channel points. Oh, for the presents and then the snowflake bits, we'll do it tomorrow on stream. Saves channel points. <laughs> okay. Get good chat, honestly. Okay, you guys can redeem the channel point skip line throughout if you want. But right now, we're gonna do randomized numbers. Because as I said, all 185 chatters have a number assigned to them. And we'll be doing them randomly. So some of these chatters you may have never seen. Some of them may not show up as often. I'm gonna get a highlighter. I think we'll be able to go a little bit quicker now because most of these people aren't in chat. So yeah, 185. Yeah, that's a lot of chatters. Like, honestly. The first stream I clicked on was an art stream, but the stream had already ended. Damn. My foot fell asleep. 
Okay, so for people that we're doing now who might not be in the chat room now, I, I need your guys' votes. Because, you know, they can't defend themselves, so I need more input from chat. So make sure you guys are voting yay or voting nay. My foot fell asleep. Also, what do you guys think of the stream format? Is it good? Is it entertaining? Are you going to chug eggnog on your cooking stream? Weird question, hacker. Weird question. My foot- okay, I would- my foot is asleep and it's all I can think about right now. Okay. I hope lemon is first. I mean, honestly, I hope. Well, um. Like, regular chatters, hopefully they don't come up. Until they actually come in. Okay, number 138. Oh, this person is- I actually remember this guy. This stream is good, thank you. I've been planning it for a while. <clears throat> okay, so we have pneumonia. Following since June, previously subbed for one month. 162 messages, so they're probably a lurker. Or they don't watch often. Let's see if we can see from the very start, since they don't have many messages. Oh, right here! June 26th, so chatted two days after they followed. <clears throat> oh my god, hello, love! Okay. I think it's a very cute and endearing thing when people call you love, but it's always kind of weird to me. It feels like something like your grandma or something would call you. <clears throat> okay. Finally caught one of your streams! I've been following you on TikTok for a while now. Love you so much. Whoa. Cute, but tone it down. <laughs> I'm gonna try to start looking whenever I see one, so I'll be sure to be a number... So I'll be sure to be a number and chat sometimes. Cool. Also, I love your blazer so much. That color is adorable. <laughs> Red flags. <laughs> uh, stop, that's so iconic. Ah, uh, Leiluki, that sounds so cute. Oh my god, the heels always came off within the hour for those school dances. Tell people are so fun to hug, to be honest. <laughs> so funny reading these back. Oh, uh, <laughs> Short people dude is unmatched though. They call me sassy. You're immediately infantilized. Bye, Dano. Have a lovely time zone. Oh, that's cute. I love when you guys say hi and bye. <clears throat> Bombs only is so fun. I love this. Love out. Peace I to L. Peace I to love. Oh, I guess they call people love by default. That's so cute. I can't with people like this. <gasps> they seem so wholesome. Yeah, the moment's pretty wholesome. And they, they lurk usually all the time. Or, I mean, I don't know. But I sometimes see, like, the users in chat. But they can, they chat occasionally. What do you guys think? <clears throat> Hope streams are snazzy. What does snazzy mean? Hmm. Frozen grapes are goaded. Dude, I don't know how people didn't hurt their teeth with that. Oh, I think we were talking about the frozen honey or some shit. How's everybody doing? Hope you're well, Megan. Aww. Oh my god, please do that. That sounds so funny. Run me my points. We love to see it. Run me my points. <laughs> the people who post drag queens from RuPaul's has reactions on Twitter so cringe. That sounds like something Krista would do, honestly. Honestly. Maybe this is heavy enough? Okay, that is okay. <clears throat> there we go. See, I love getting freaked out and having scary dreams because when I wake up, I feel alive. Dude, that's a banger line. <laughs> that's a banger. Okay, I think that pneumonia is pretty good. Meg, do you read or watch One Piece? No, why would you ask that? My room is filled. What? I have a wall of the bounty posters. This is so cool to see your process. Thank you for real. Aww. That's good. I think even it was kind of sus. Like, they're opening messages. Hello, love. 
I love you so much. Kinda cringe. Kinda cringe. I think pneumonia is pretty good. I think pneumonia is good. And if you're lurking and you see this pneumonia, you are good. Good chatter. As we talked about earlier, all lurkers are good. Right now, we're only really showcasing... ...the people who are active in chat. <laughs> yeah, Deacon will usually pop in for a few minutes because of time zones and then school. Okay, next. Number 30. Now, some of these chatters you guys might not recognize at all. Because I know I didn't recognize some of them. Okay, we have Niner Gang 1, 2, 3, 2, 3. Following since February 14th. Interesting. Because February 14th was my Valentine's Day stream. And this was the stream where my title was Going on a totally real, not fake date with chat. So this person probably found me on just chatting. 15 messages. Not an active viewer, maybe a lurker. February 14th, so followed and chatted right away. Hello, true. Only perfect day I would get is a good game day. <laughs> Eating out is a good birthday, true. We all type words. Yeah, I value personality. I like almond chocolate, lol. February, lol. All right, steak or ribs? Joking about mom or dads. Yeah. And then the next time they chatted, July 9th. W Fisherwoman for sure. For sure. On God, on God. Okay, so that must have been for the Animal Crossing fishing tourney then. Hmm. Nothing bad. Nothing weird. I think pretty solid. What do you guys think? I think they're pretty good. We don't see them often. Because that's the thing I kind of forget whenever I stream. Is that, um... <laughs> Not enough evidence to prove guilty true. I mean, there's some people who literally have just said hi and have never chatted again. So I think Niner's pretty good. Something that does kind of bother me is, you know how whenever we get a new chatter and I ask, Oh, welcome in. Do you have any preferred nicknames or pronouns? And then they don't answer. I, I, I get kind of off put. I'm just like, why didn't you answer the question? It's not like I'm asking you how your day is, you don't... I don't... <laughs> I'm not asking you guys to trauma dump. <laughs> Dude, we're, everybody's gonna keep clowning on the guy forever. Hi Luigi, welcome in. Um, check out the pin message to see what we're doing today. The only way to hear a Nick's secret, not really. It's probably sus. Okay, next person. I know this guy. All right, I don't know them, but I recognize the username. Yeah, true, Crystal. But you said you like when I call you Crystal. Okay, we have Scott Penguinsers following since March. Previously sub for three. I think those are all gifted. 266 messages. We can probably find the start. Okay, so they chatted three days after they followed. Something that is kind of nice to me, and that a few chatters have also said themselves, is they definitely will lurk for a few streams and then finally chat before they, because like that way they can like feel out the vibes and shit, right? <clears throat> so, March 10th. Hello, we got this. March 29th. Back. Well, hello there. Who else is hyped for the stream? Fingers crossed it works well. Saint, I love listening to her stories. Close one. That's me. You'll totally forget this round. What? Are you gonna play the rainbow map the stream? Eighth place. Peace I to snicker. <laughs> oh, 
Okay, so nothing... I love to watch Ludwig. Me too. How many times will you fall off? Ha ha ha. It's not very nice. It's kind of mean. Your content deserves so much viewers. Thank you. I... Okay. Th this is... The, any type of comments like this, your content deserves so much more viewers. It, it's kind of like a weird thing to say to me. Do you guys not like Ludwig? What? Anyway. It, it's kind of a weird thing. Because... It, I understand it's supposed to be something nice, but it's still kind of like... Reminding the personality of the streamer of the fact that they don't have a large platform. It's kind of like... It's not a backhanded compliment, but it's still kind of weird. I don't know. Hmm. I love how you apologize right after the slightest insult. It's very funny. Yeah. <laughs> I spent all my points to get my user written especially so I can't save you. <laughs> you better win. I just put 50 points in for you winning. That's like all my points. No! They must have lost those 50 points. <laughs> Is it your birthday? Was it my birthday? No, no, no. It was after my birthday, I think. <laughs> I think it's so funny when people use, like, the default emojis. <laughs> Happy birthday! Oh, they did show up for the birthday stream. Good chatter, good chatter. It's solidified. Scott's good. I don't think we've seen Scott in a while, though. Yeah, last chat message was August. Mod check Scott? That's interesting, because that means they watched before my peak, and then left right after I peaked. Could be just, like, school and shit. You know what else is shitty? Having to watch ads because chatters we are an hour in the stream. So it's time for you, or it's time for me to run some ads. So if you want to avoid that ad, all you gotta do is subscribe for 4 99 just five dollars, skip your coffee, and get ad free viewing all month long. Or you can link everyone right here to Twitch and hashtag sub free with Prime. Click subscribe, see if you have a sub available. Anyway, get some water, get a snack, we'll see some of you guys in a few. Well, heck, you're a special case, of course. <laughs> of course. Okay, let's get back to work. We have a lot to get through. This person, A4 Rules, following since April 19th, previously subbed for one month. 14 messages, so not an active viewer. Or chatter, rather. First message, the day they followed, so April 19th. Hey doll, I didn't even know Ludwig moved to YouTube. I always wonder why I didn't see his streams. <laughs> <laughs> Never! Cherry trees are so cute. My island started with ugly oranges. Dude, the oranges are so nice. And there's so much more versatile for, like, the cooking. That was funny. Like, <laughs> five of their messages from that day are Ludwig related. Next message. 421. Hold on. Kettle chips sound so good right now. I'm scared. Not zero lives. And then birthday stream. Slay. I don't like saying slay. I, I don't use it in my vernacular. Oh my god, happy birthday! <laughs> and then April 28th. Their last three messages in my chat room. At least it's not like Kennedy Davenport who called me a me- What? A Mimi? What? Oh, May May. Oh, okay. Same! But I have a bad cough at the moment, so I can't get any. Broken heart. Add vengeance is pog scene. Who is Ludwig? They're a YouTuber. They used to be a Twitch streamer, but now they're a YouTube streamer. Hmm, why do you guys keep saying nay? I think nothing crazy. Are you guys really gonna say A4 rules is a bad chatter, a naughty chatter? 
Okay, the next vote decides. The next vote decides. Are they good or bad? I'm indifferent. I will sing a song? Fuck. I was gonna do that tomorrow. Ah, no leaks! I was gonna do Christmas carols tomorrow. They don't chat enough to choose? That's what I was thinking. I was like, they haven't said anything crazy. I agree with the Knicks. I agree. I agree. We don't have enough evidence for or against. Okay. Well, I guess... Do I have to sing a song? I should have taken away. <laughs> twinkle, twinkle, little star ASMR. No. No. Okay, so... Let's say... I gotta find a song. It should be muted on your guys' end, so you shouldn't hear it. June <clears throat> okay, I'm searching for a song. In the middle of Hollywood Boulevard, scream at each other, scream at each other. That's not the song I'm going to do today, but I'm trying to learn it. How was the man who never lied, never lied until today? I'm trying to learn it. Anyway, I'm going to do a different Maroon 5 song. <clears throat> Why is it playing? Oopsie. Okay. I want to do She Will Be Loved. <clears throat> this is one of my mom's favorite songs. She does not like when I sing it, though. <laughs> so, chatters, if you all could spam your favorite emotes, your favorite animated emotes, I'd appreciate it. <clears throat> it's been a while since we've sung a song. Yeah. So nervous. Is yeah for nice because I'm seeing a lot of nays. Yeah. Yeah is nice. Nay is naughty. <laughs> okay, okay. That was funny. Okay. I'm gonna try and do the open verse and then part of the chorus. <clears throat> I didn't warm up today either. Beauty queen of only 18, she had some trouble with herself. He was always there to help her, she always belonged to someone else. I drove for miles and miles and wound up at your door. I've had you so many times, but somehow I want more. I don't mind spending every day out on your corner in the pouring rain. Look for the girl with the broken smile. Ask her if she wants to stay a while, and she will. She will be loved. Tap on my window, knock on my door. I want to make you feel beautiful. Oh, it's such a nice song. Thank you, guys. Thank you, guys. It's such a nice song. 
I used to not like it because my mom would play it all the time. But it's so good. I will post a Twitter draft now. Thank you for redeeming, Hacker. Once again, thank you, Potato, for redeeming with your channel points to sing. I haven't sung that song in a long time. But it's definitely up there. I'm surprised I haven't sung it on stream before. I usually don't like when you go, um... <clears throat> And she will. I can't do that part as well. Okay, it's been a while since we've done a Twitter draft. Um, everybody, go follow my Twitter. That way you can see the Twitter, the tweet drop. I'm not gonna tell you what the tweet is. You guys have to see it on Twitter. I'm not gonna show chat. You guys have to see it. Thank you for retweeting my tweet, Crystal. I appreciate it. Okay. Let's see if I have any bangers. <laughs> dude i have a lot of like dude my foot's asleep again tap on my window knock on my door i wanna make you feel beautiful yeah megaphone streamer <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. There I have some drafts that I literally can never tweet because the jokes are way too edgy. I don't have Twitter though? Damn. Um, have another chatter tell you what the tweet is. Easy. <laughs> okay, do you want another like fucking lived up tweet? Because I think it was last week where I was like, they teach you in school. That you have the right to food, water, and shelter. I was feeling really lived up and sad and mad at the world. I think that was the day where I got my disability not approved. <clears throat> you guys want another lived up one? I don't like having any good funny ones. <laughs> Except for the edgy ones I get. Oh yeah, you're right, hacker. You don't I don't think you need an account. Okay, I'm gonna do the lived up tweet. We're libs, because we're being nice today. We're fucking lived up. It's up, it's up, it's posted. Go like it, go go reply to it. Fucking lived up tweet. I hate being a socialist. <laughs> Even though I have no money to give. Hopefully Santa will see that and say I'm good and nice. Okay, let's get back to work. We, we took a brief break. Oh, whoa. That was weird. Okay, anyway. Back to work. It's not live if it's like literally how the world should be. Oh wait, hold, hold, hold. My sister texted me. She literally just texted me. Hold. She gets to leave work early. So she might get me McDonald's for lunch. Let's fucking go. Okay, back to work. We reviewed A4 rules. So, agent reminder, if you want to skip the line and have me look at the logs now, you can redeem with your channel points. Otherwise, we're gonna, gonna keep doing random names. Ah, oh, come on! I, I, it chose the person right before Cutie Lee. I wanna roast Cutie Lee so hard. Okay, it's fine. Okay, so we have Rex Dragon 411. Following since August 30th, 2021. So following for a year and a half. 
147 messages. So Rex is a chatter from Rainy Day Games' streams chat. Oh my god, Lemon's here! Redeem with your channel points. A <laughs> loser? What? Mods ban hacker. What? What is this trash talk? <laughs> Who are you calling a loser? Wait, we need to pause. Who are you calling a loser? Huh? They said it? Oh. I mean, Rex Dragon, they do trash talk a lot. Not in my chat, because I usually, like, have them tone it down. But in Rainy's chat, they always backseat game. They always trash talk. But they behave well in my chat. So that's something I have to keep in mind. Yeah, bad chatter. But remember, we are thinking about how they behave in my chat. Ooh, pretty. <laughs> Can't be my stick figures, though. I, I just saw the first four words and I got scared. Anyway. Anyway. Stick figure animations were low-key cool. Stick figures all I got. Do you draw art for fun? This- Oh, this was September. This is when I was still doing, like, art streams every day. Um... E, I agree. You play Mario? Sorry, I got a little focused on Pokemon Go. Yeah. Sorry, my sister... <laughs> She's like, maybe I'll get you McDonald's. Bitch. Sorry. Yep, crazy my middle name. Self-report. Now I won't try to play Smash. I'm playing Spirits. <laughs> the people who put low. <laughs> Okay, I'm trying to see if they backseat game in my chat. All oh, high, beautiful voice. That was probably when I was singing. I hope you're doing well, peace and all. I want Chick fil A, me too. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, this was. They're adding Bruh Fairy. It's been a while since we've seen her. Because she's had some health complications. I hope she's okay. Oh, thank you, Nyx. Nyx is always good. Thank you, Nyx. I appreciate it. I I'm actually gonna read it out. Meg, I'm super proud of you for being firm in your stances, especially in your chat. It's your space, and I'm glad you shaped it into a place where we can all feel comfy to chat and be a positive uh, community. Glad you've been a part of my year. Thank you for hosting such a positive and inviting commu <laughs> community and being such a fun streamer. Whenever I tune in, it's always a good time. Ha ha. Anyways, bad backseat gamer. <laughs> Chick fil A bad, but it's so good. <laughs> okay, I, I do not see any instance of Rex backseat game. I think it's because I don't play games that they play. Why do you, why you guys hate it? You literally have never seen Rex. Ha, huh, nerd. <gasps> Four eyes? Lose, lose, lose. Pull out, Kappa. <laughs> Guys, choose heavy. All the heavy characters. Imagine. <laughs> this is February. Oh, we're at the end. We're at the end. Loser. Okay, that's one way to, like, enter a stream. Last ever message in my chat. March 30th, 11.28 a.m. So this must have been right after I started stream. Loser, I'm good, how are you? I got a freaking puppy. They're called kittens. Yes, they are. I looked it up. Angry face. I feel insulted. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Just based on how they opened with Loser for their last ever stream they chatted in, I think that's pretty naughty. I and I don't think I saw a single chatter about yay. So if Rex ever comes back and see how you guys ostracize them, I don't think they'll like it. But I think Rex has been pretty naughty. Because we're looking at messages from this year. So I think Rex has been pretty naughty. Our second naughty chatter of the day. 
kind of cringe. <laughs> Man, no. They haven't done anything bad. <laughs> Too many anti-winning schemes, true. Okay, we have Luigi redeem skip the line. So let's see what... Ooh, Luigi's gonna be interesting. Now, Luigi, you have to promise you won't get upset because we're doing this for fun. Nyx was labeled a naughty chatter. So don't be mad if chat does not vote accordingly. So, Luigi Gamer... Oh no. Okay. A thousand plus messages following since June 1st. Tier 1 sub gifted for four months. What is this? A timeout. Now, this timeout was on October 23rd. I wonder why this happened. So that timeout is from... I <laughs> want So. Everybody promise we aren't going to be too hard on Luigi because they are reformed. They spent their time and they have changed for the better. It was Splatoon, yes. It was the Squid Game stream. So what happened was I was playing Splatoon for the first time ever. I am not good <laughs> I believe Luigi's nice. <laughs> so, I was playing Splatoon for the first time ever, and one of my chat rules. Let's actually pull up the rules. Rules. Follow them to a T. Keep chat messages PG-13. No vulgar or subjective jokes or messages. No spoilers or backseat gaming. If she wants hints or tips, she will explicitly ask for it. So, rule number one, two... Three. Rule number three, no backseat gaming. I'm one of the few people to where I like to experience things on my own. I don't like when people tell me what to do. Even in general, I don't like being bossed around, but I am very bossed myself, so. I don't like backseat gaming. So, we were playing. <laughs> I didn't see the best. Let's find it, let's find the offense. Because I think this is the main determinant factor. Because I think Luigi is pretty wholesome for the most part. I think, um, Luigi is also very, like, straightforward and kind of clueless at times. In a good way. In a good way. But. So, I think in general, ever since the reform, I'll defeat Chet. Peace, I do punch. <laughs> okay, we're almost at it. So, let's find the day. Let's find the day. And it's so cute. They always say bye. And I think that's really sweet. <gasps> right here. Right here, right here. <clears throat> right here. So, I had been live for about an hour at this point. And for the whole hour, Luigi's giving, like, tips and tricks that I don't necessarily want. And if anybody watches back the VOD, you can obviously see that I'm getting annoyed. Right? So, after an hour, I timed them out for 10 minutes. Oh, this was so cute. Why was I timed out for 557 seconds? I didn't do anything bad. Peace out to L. Luigi's a good person. Sad. Backseat. I don't know what that is. <laughs> See, that's why I think at times Luigi's clueless, but in a good way, because they don't necessarily understand that it's kind of like not okay to do. But ever since that time up, they have not backseat gamed a single time. So I think that goes to show. Even if you have a timeout, you can change for the better, and if you can prove yourself, you're a good chatter. Luigi didn't do it on purpose. I agree. I think Luigi is good. Luigi is good. And I think it's also because Luigi watches on mobile, so they have a delay. <laughs> I'm a reform Luigi. Exactly. Exactly. Okay. Next.
Delay isn't that bad anymore, true. I mean, I still get a decent delay sometimes. Okay, next. Oh, skip the line. Thank you for redeeming Lemon. I literally just redeemed. Shadows were waiting for Lemon's logs. Oh, what? There we go. Okay. This is gonna be so good. <laughs> Iced Lemon Vanilla. Following since May 30th, tier 1 sub for 7 months. You've gotten gifted nearly every single month, you lucky little fuck. Oh, right here. Let's, let's skip back past today's logs. Now, Lemon is fairly active in chat. We don't necessarily see them as often because of school. Sad. Why would you be scared? Everybody else is excited. <laughs> Me when mayo. Peace I too hard. Have you ever had a mayo popsicle? No. Where are the cake pops going? In my ass, obviously. <laughs> I'm getting. I'm getting. Why would you want to eat a cookie with salt? I don't get why you guys were shitting on the cookies with salt recipes. They aren't that bad. Guys, I'm joking. It's called comedy. I'm going to my aunt's. Peace out to smile. How did you come up with your username? <laughs> Somebody clip. I'm on mobile too. I did. Lemon, you've made one clip and only one clip on my channel. So you no longer can lie and say you don't know how to clip. <laughs> Mac tweets have started appearing in my notifications and I'm scared. <laughs> I don't follow you. I just don't use Twitter a lot. Oh, I think they're talking about Mac. Spin attack. Oh, the RP. I like eggs. Peace out to evil smile. I think Mac is onto something. I can talk again. Gage. <laughs> Have you found Aurora yet? Peace I to Snicker. Can I move in too? Peace I to Evil Smile. Uh oh. Ah, uh, like I said, that six month mark, that parasocial Andy. You did a cringe? That's not very nice. Okay, I don't even think we can even get to the start of Lemon's Logs, because they spam a lot like Magdo does. When did you talk about mayo on the cake stream? What even brought up the topic of mayo? I don't remember. Okie dokie! Don't bad things happen if you drug people too many times? What? What? Are you the bad guy? What the fuck are we talking- Oh, this was the Halloween stream. 1027, okay. Okay. All lettuce is good. Imagine smelling an emote wrong. Wow. I need to go, but it looks great. Aw. Oh. Okay, what do you got? I think Lemon's a pretty good chatter. Lemon is pretty- Okay, you want to know what makes Lemon a really good chatter? I remember one day we raided Scootish and uh, I think he was playing Odyssey. And Lemon, what what were you talking about? You were talking about some random ass shit. Because I think it was something related to like flour or pasta. And like it actually made Scootish laugh a lot. And it, it takes a lot to get Scootish and you got Scootish to laugh. So I think that's good. <clears throat> Lemon best chatter. No, Batty's the best chatter. Oh, shit. We'll do a capital I. It wasn't pasta? What was it then? I feel like it was something like that though, right? Okay, next. If you want to skip the line, all you gotta do is use your channel points. Alright, now we're doing random. What was it then? I don't know. I don't have mod in Scootish's channel. I don't fucking know. But it was funny. Okay, next we have Charlie. 15 messages, zero timeouts. Following since July, 
Previously subbed for two months, probably gifted. First ever message, July 27th, so the same day they followed. Hi, do you want to play user Owl Shark? Hi. What? Oh, oh, they left it for an hour from Lurk. Eight, August 2nd, oh my god, thank you. August 21st, hi. October 30th, hello, hello, exclamation shout out. Why they put shout out? That was weird. Last ever day they chatted, November 1st, follow age, I'm following, and I've been following for three months. Yay, watch time. <laughs> this is random. Uh. <laughs> I mean, it just, it, this person's probably a lurker. Probably a lurker. So nothing crazy. The only, like, sus thing is the exclamation shout out. That was kind of weird. Like, I, are, did they think it would shout themselves out? Like, huh? No free clout. No purse, no free clout. What do you guys think? I, I There's, like, not enough. Yay, heart. Peace I to love. Peace I to vibe. That is pretty good when they use the emotes. Emote spammers are good chatters. Next person who types in chat decides. What do you guys think? I don't know. There's nothing bad, but there's also nothing crazy. Like, crazy good either. See, that's the problem with, like, lurkers? Yeah? Okay. Who? The following thing at the end looks like they want attention. Yeah. No, I don't ever do shoutouts. <laughs> I don't, whenever I get rated either, I don't shout out the channel. Especially if it's someone I don't know. I mean, that's how some people are, and that's fine. But you guys don't know, or you guys know I don't like when people bait for attention. But they're fine. Nothing crazy. I'm sure all of you guys watching now have had worse offenses. Okay, I also need to cut my paper. Because the list is getting long. Butcher paper. I've had no offenses on the channel, Kappa. If we would have like deep dived into your logs, we definitely would have found something. Was my worst offense your Pikachu fell? Yes. It's fine if you do it one time, but if you do it like every other stream, it's annoying. Not gonna lie. That's why I usually ignore it. It fell right now. Actually, no, it did not. Okay, next. 158. Next defendant. We have QPier64 following since July, so at my peak, 10 messages. <laughs> First message, the day they followed. Hi, I'm Q. Very nice. Next message, July 26. Hey, what's up? 200 CC. I like variety. Cat Peach. Cat Peach. This is one you guys could choose my character. That's why it shows up in chat. Um, this is the very first time I used channel points. 151 left. We all been waiting on the next wave of tracks. This seems like a Mario Kart frog, and I love the Mario Kart frogs because I like playing Mario Kart. Nothing crazy here. Just normal. Nothing bad. Oh, 151 channel points, I assume. I think this person's good. Nothing crazy. Just normal chatter. Looks like they came in a few times and then... Have a comeback, Sag. Sag. But you know, it's fine. Not everybody's gonna be an active viewer, and that's fine. But I think Pierce is pretty cool. Nothing bad, nothing good. Or, not nothing good. It's like... Emotes make a good chatter. And don't ever be scared to chat. 
You know, we goof, we gaff. Yeah, nothing notable. <laughs> exactly. Not memorable. Because, like, half of my chatters that I had written down, I literally don't remember. <laughs> they didn't say bye when they left. You know what's interesting? Some streamers don't like when you announce you're leaving. Because they're like, oh, you're leaving to go do something else? That's cringe. Like, why are you leaving the stream? Guys. The one I've been waiting for. Randomly chosen. We have Cutie Lee. Following since August 25th, 2021. Previously subbed for eight months. I think Cutie Lee was gifted a few times and then she was a previous sub. I want to see if I can find the very beginning. Because Cutie Lee, I found her because we went to high school together because she's a class younger than me. But, um, I found out she streamed and then we kind of reconnected. Now, Cutie Lee's interesting. Because since I know her IRL, she definitely can skirt the lines. <laughs> Look, right here! Right here! She can skirt the lines a little bit. Right here, she opens with... 218, Mommy. I don't like that. <laughs> right here, okay, okay, I'll be quiet now. <laughs> Probably because I grilled her. What is the emote spam? What was this? You pervert? What? What? What is this accusation? I said no such thing. I'm not as funny as Megan, confirmed. Fazanavi. <laughs> exactly. I am hilarious. Uses a Piplup emote. I think that's one of Rainy's emotes. It's because you expect me to be the child. Megan will not expect that from. It's because you give off home honor vibes. I do. Like the low-key cool English teacher that no one likes unless they're close with her. Choke the- cho What? Choke the child? I would never say that in the chat room. Never. Wait, when is this? Oh, this was- Okay, so I did a collab stream right after Valentine's Day where I had a joke. What was it? I was like, if I were a superhero, what would I be? And I think I did- I would be super strong so I could choke- No! It was what- it, what Smash character do you think you could be to fight? And I chose the Animal Crossing Villager. And I drew a picture of it. And I was like, you know, it's so small, it's so easy to pick up, I can easily choke it out. And I was RPing as like a Yandere girl, but people didn't know I was RPing and they just thought I was fucking crazy. Uh, that's why the choking bit. Was it? Oh, this is back when I played fucking... Pokemon, unite. Choke, why are you guys saying yeah to choke the child? <laughs> oh no. Oh no. <gasps> but yeah, anyway guys, come over to my stream, lol. Is that so promo? Oh no. She's a medicine private, I am. Oh no. How do you feel about PDA? I love it. White chocolate is icky. White chocolate is so good. <laughs> I'm not gonna say it. I'm not gonna say it. <laughs> I say it ironically all the time, guys. Guys. I'm a DJ, and yes, you are. Imagine playing Animal Crossing. You know what's funny? Cutie Lee told me in private one time. That when she plays Animal Crossing, she specifically makes outfits for every activity. Like, she has a fishing fit, she has a gardening fit, and she grows me. Death by train. Sag. Oh, this is the Valentine's Day stream. <laughs> Ban me? I'll do it. Bitch, I'll do it. <laughs> I think we might actually find the start. Oh, this is from February. Wait, I don't think we've seen Cuter in a while. Yeah, last message, November. I mean, it's been a month. She also has a stream in a while because she's been having, like, setup issues. I think she's moving to California. So, wowie. 
I think... You know, Kitty Lee gets a pass. She gets a pass. Even though she has broken the simp rules many times. She gets a pass, because she's a friend. So she's a good chatter. Okay, next, chatter. <laughs> I have my finger on the band button. <laughs> right here. You guys can't see it, but it's on the trigger. <laughs> okay, we have fish underscore underscore zero one. Following since February 15th, so right after the Valentine's Day stream. So they followed in February, but they didn't chat until April. Literally. It's always middle school boys. Hashtag scary. Yo! Spongebob persona. Yeah, it's pretty solid. <laughs> Their second message has me dying. Yeah, I feel like if this person were more active, I feel like they'd be funny. Come back. Come back, fish, please. We need more funny chatters. See, even though they have three messages, they are bangers. I love seeing, like, little mouths or yo's in my chat. It reminds me of the W community, and I want to, like, sneak my way in there. Why are you saying nay? I think they're pretty good. Like, you know, they were in chat for three minutes, dropped some bangers, and then they left. Nice. I think fish is good. Contrary to Potato's belief, I think fish is good. We just need them to come back. Potatoes in middle school, boy. <laughs> Love wow. Don't chatters. Don't self-report on your ages. Don't self-report. Okay, next. We have to start speed running because we're already. Wait, we're an hour thirty in the stream, so it's time for me to tell you if you're new here. Follow the channel and. You get cool emotes, and you get to type a chat, and if you are already following me, you should have notifications turned on. That way you get pinged when I go live. Wow. <gasps> no way. No way. Not randomly. No way. We randomly got titans. Ain't no way. I wish I could see when titans first started chatting. Because I don't think they chatted for a while. Bandas. Oh well. Sad Titans, you're gonna have to watch the VOD if you come in the chat later. Sag. My apartment is shaking for Meg. I plead the fifth. That is that is okay. We like Titans. Titans is a good chatter. They're an oiler. Actually not really though. But they do skirt the lines a little bit sometimes. <laughs> Bad chatter. <laughs> Demon Meg, just talk about me. Talk about every poor character trait you think I possess. Now, I don't like to label people, but Titans is very. Wait, what is this? I saw an Autobahn message. Where is it? They are. Yes, they like when we make fun of them, so I don't know if it's good to label them a bad chatter, because they might like that. Get out. <laughs> the mouth that got automated. <laughs> you were wigging out the camera. That's called Blinky Meg. My money is returned. Yeah, add time. Member. What? That's weird. I really don't like at Titans. <laughs> Dude, what is this? Oh my god, name call me. I'm not a masochist. Who gave you that idea? Uh... Okay, just looking at what chatters have said so far. We've- I've literally seen no yays. I don't think we need to go further. Because what Titans is us? They come in, they say hi, they self-deprecate, they act sus, and then they leave. And we like that. I 
I, dude, I wish I could keep scrolling. Yeah, I think Titans is a naughty chatter. And naughty in a bad way, not in a good way. Okay, Titans is a naughty chatter. Thank you for redeeming, Ed. We will do you next. I think Titans is naughty chatter. Now, naughty doesn't necessarily mean bad, keep in mind. Okay, hey, next we have Ed. There we go. Ooh, only 160 messages. We love that. We can easily scroll up. Following since May. Yeah, that's you. Let's see. Oh my god, a TikTok frog! We love the TikTok frogs! So they followed on May 29th. First time chat on the same day. I always see you on my For You on TikTok. I have to follow. LOL. Cool. Join the tournament. That sounds epic, to be honest. That Pikachu sleeps better than me. Thanks, M.A.B. Now, I think Ed, not necessarily an active chatter, but I see me lurk a lot. Because, like, you're here today. You've been following since May. But whenever you're in stream, you are fairly active, which is good. Hey. Oh, wait. Wait, I'm right here. Right here. <laughs> hey, oh my god, not this game. I quit after I owed like 250k. <laughs> Imagine eating tomatoes. Sing the ABC's Baby Shark? Oh, that was probably when I sang a song. I'm, I'm so confused. Who's ga Gog? Gage. Oh. <laughs> I didn't even know you could catch the bees. I thought the bites were inevitable, but it makes sense. Yeah, I'm a fucking cracked at Animal Crossing. <gasps> oh, interesting. I've seen people in chat get sad because the streamer doesn't notice them, but they have like 50k chatters. Based. There's also chatters where they think they're superior to newer chatters because they've been there longer. Interesting coming from a guy who's been following since May. <laughs> but based take. Based take. Did you glue the Pikachu? How does it not fall? I taped it. Easy. The stream title? What is the stream title? <laughs> Third place W, lol. Not my sub expiring, can't use the cooling mods. <gasps> Are you trying to bait to gift somebody as for somebody to gift you? That's cringe. That's cringe. That's cringe. Offense number one. Don't do that shit. Because you're like, oh my god, I don't have a sub. Oh no. I hate when people bait gifters. It's fine, just don't don't do that shit. It's it's annoying. That's why I tell all my chatters. Potential gifters, do not gift people who bait you, okay? It's cringe. I think I grilled potato for it one time. I think his potato was like, oh my god, I don't have a sub. And then I was like, do not gift potato a sub. And then they had to redeem with their channel points that month. <laughs> so just don't. <laughs> Why I kind of want to see an ad. <laughs> I think it's good. Last time we saw them was December 21st, today. Oh, you're from California? Another PST viewer? We don't have many PST people. I have a lot of East Coasters. Yeah, so it's not often we see Ed, but they are a good chatter whenever they come in. So I think Ed, good chatter. Thank you for redeeming. Next, we had Giorgio redeem, or Gio. I think Giorgio is so much more fun to say, though. Oops, spelled it wrong. A 
Okay, offense number one. People have double digits in their name. Double J, double I. Kind of cringe. I hate typing it in. Maybe I'll forgive you. Following since March? No way. No way. Have you really been following me for that long? What was you even playing in March? Okay, I think we can scroll all the way to the top because they have 400 messages. Okay, right here, right here. I'll change my name. Don't, honey, please don't. Don't. I have to go to work, but do we have plans for New Year's? Um, I think plan for next week's streams is gonna be all the bonus streams. And then, I don't think I'll stream on New Year's. Because I have my sister's birthday and my friend's birthday next week, so. Just follow my Twitter, that way you get notified for when I go live. But for New Year's plans, probably not. I don't celebrate, we don't do fireworks because I'm scared. I think I follow because of Mario Kart? Interesting. <gasps> you did follow for Mario Kart, look at this! Oh no. Oh no. Hi, 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 hi. First stream here as well. It's just Geo, he, him, lol. Are we able to join you? Giorgio, I need- or Gio, I need you to explain yourself. So you- did you find me on the Discover page? Because anybody who finds me on the Discover page for Mario Kart, they're like, Oh my god, can I play with you? And they're usually probably like fucking 10 year olds. Did you find me on Discover hoping you could play in my game? Be honest. I found you on TikTok? Okay. Hmm. Hmm, that's better. I do like the TikTok TikTok frogs. <gasps> do you have a Discord server? If not, you should make one. Why does everybody Okay, if anybody asks do you have a Discord, you're automatically sus. Automatically sus, okay? That means you want to get close to me and that's cringe. Bye Nix! We'll see you next time, honey. It's a pleasure as always. Thank you for hanging out today. Sorry that you're a naughty chatter. Next year do better. <laughs> Oh, so this must have been for tournaments. Wait, was this the month that Giorgio won? <gasps> An auto-modded message? I hate you, Vengeance, respectfully. No, Vengeance is cool. Also, nice job on the second. Ooh, encouragement, we love that. Wait, do I have it? Oh yeah, this was the tournament you won! In, ju in June. Wait, do I have it testing? Yeah, because that's when you were seeing if you had the badge. Thanks for hosting such a fun tourney today. Hopefully I can join in the future. Aw, wholesome chatter. <laughs> Bridge. <laughs> okay, just skimming. Wait. Pet peeve of mine. I hate when somebody gets mad at you for looking up something in the game. I agree. Look up a walkthrough if you feel like you need to. Hey, playing Mario Kart. I'm ashamed that I had two online girlfriends in New Leaf as a 13-year-old. What? Explain. What is this? What? You were a player? Players aren't good. That's very bad. I know we're looking at the Twitch chat, but if you're a player at the age of 13, that's not very good. Of course. No, explain. Explain. That's very bad. Yeah, I think that's the name. What? You had two online girlfriends? You were leading them both on? Oh my god. Oh, and this is all the holiday streams. Lamau. <laughs> WG. Stop. We don't like players. <laughs> oh my god. We don't like players. <laughs> No, it, it, he said two online girlfriends at the same time when I was 13. That's what the quote was. I don't know. Were you just lying to feel cool even though players aren't cool? What? I don't remember. Well, you typed it in chat so you must have remembered at some point. I have my finger over the ban button. I don't like players. <laughs> Okay, okay. We we can gloss over it. You know, 13, you're young, you're dumb. 
as a whole, Giorgio is pretty awesome. Pretty good. But they did ask if they could play a Mario Kart game with me. And that's cringe. Wait, do I have a command for that actually? Oh, what is that? Oh. Okay, I have to disable that command later. I think Giorgio, we can we can gloss over the two online girlfriends. As long as you broke up with them. Everything else since, Giorgio has been fairly active this month, I assume because of holiday break. And you're good. Giorgio's good. I didn't know it was when I first joined. No, it was like your third stream, I think it was. Like, just skirting through. Next. Gentle reminder, if you want to skip the line, all you gotta do is use your channel points. Yeah, get back to work, Nix. Can't be blaming me for everything. Okay, so next we have Noah. Following since June, 18 messages. So not a lot of evidence for this one. Yo, I finally got a no notification that you're live. Found you on TikTok. Ooh, a TikTok frog. Hi, everyone. I lost my Animal Crossing game card as soon as summer break started. Surprise. Hoping to buy a new one. I keep the game cards in the cases, but my little brother found out how to take out the cards, so once we did that, the game disappeared. He's won. Zero clue how we will make money. <laughs> Thank you, Mac. You didn't have to do that. Oh, they probably got gifted. I'm gonna sell his toys. Giga chat. Honestly. 60 sub goal. Ain't no way. I'm gonna be camping on Thursday. I'll use the last of my phone juice to watch your stream. <laughs> I came back to you singing. Yeah, in four minutes. Got fish to eat. <laughs> While camping? What? <laughs> Praying for you, Mac. Is there a Discord? Gotta hopefully it doesn't damage my growing. <laughs> okay, okay. So this person was here for one stream. Theoretically, they have notifications turned on. Why haven't they come up for another stream? But their second to last message was, is there a Discord? Guess their phone never got charged again? Maybe, that could actually be it. Maybe they just never came back from camping. That's what I think about sometimes, I'm like... I assume people get bored and they just don't watch. But what if they like actually got, like died or some shit? I don't know. Is there a Discord? That is red flag number one. We do not have a Discord. Anybody who asks if there's a Discord is sus automatically. But I think that's a funny anecdotal story talking about how the one-year-old sibling possibly ate the game card. I think that's a good story. Nothing bad. Nothing bad. Besides the Discord. But that, that I can look over. I think this person is good. I'm not gonna listen to you guys. The grammar doesn't matter. I, I literally can't type well, so I have bad grammar all the time. I can forgive bad grammar. Number 28. Okay. Following since February 12th. Only 17 messages. My favorite number. First chat. Valentine's Day. Um, I'm an introvert, so I love when an extrovert friend adopts me. My name is Leo, my pronouns are he, him, they, them. Thanks for asking. Lamau! 
There was a girl in my elementary school that would follow me around everywhere and hug me as tight as humanly possible. They look amazing. This was during Valentine's Day, and I did a stream where I answered, like, intimate, not intimate, but, like, more personal questions, so that's why people are talking about those topics. <clears throat> Next chat, July 7th, or February 17th. You got this big W. Love it. Goofy's laugh is my favorite. And then February 22nd, I'd love to see that, too. March 2nd. You can do it. That was wild. Let's go. I'm in a bit of a gambling high right now. 665. I'm definitely saving points for you to sing a song. Sad fix. Okay. Looks like they only came in for like a two week window. But for that two week window, they were good. You know, they answered the questions when asked. Very encouraging. You can do it. You got this. I think this person's good. Nothing bad. It does seem like they like gambling, though, and that's kind of a bad thing. But as long as they tackle their addiction, I think they'll be fine. They seem kind of funny, yeah. Hopefully they come back. One day, copium. They give Cokes vibes? That's what I was kind of thinking, too. Mod check Cokes. I need to cut more paper. I was gonna do two columns of names, but I think just doing one name per line is funnier. I miss Cokes. Oh. They're probably busy. I mean, I assume Cokes is a lurker, though. I don't chat the whole stream either. I usually lurk and then pop in every bit if I think of something funny to say. Because I think it's absolutely like psychotic to expect your viewers to be active your whole stream. Like I hate seeing clips where people talk about that thing. Okay. It's almost time for our next user. But you know what else is time for? An ad, because chatters, we are two hours into stream, so it's time for me to run a few minutes of ads. You can avoid that ad by subscribing for $4.99, just $5. Skip your coffee and get ad free viewing all month long, or you can link your Amazon Prime to your Twitch and hashtag sub for free with Prime. Click subscribe, see if you have a Prime sub available. After the ad, we're gonna keep on going. Um, I don't know if we're gonna get through everybody, so if you are here now and you wanna make sure you have your logs reviewed and get on the list reuse your channel points and skip the line seven out of ten thank you that's right get boomed non-subs yeah school sucks not gonna lie <laughs> Thank you for that recent rainy peace I too love. I hope you're doing well today, huh? Can we get some peace I too use for rainy rare chatter? Welcome in. Rainy, you wanna you wanna look at your logs? Use your channel points. Use your channel points. I know you have a lot. You lurk all the time. <laughs> okay. Oh, you're gonna get your name written at the end of stream. Thank you, Rainy. Wait! Nine months? Hold. Rainy has a flower next to their name now. They're now- they can now get clout in this chat room. <laughs> okay, next, we have Kalima, V. Kalima. I remember this chatter. The <laughs> catch-up chat? <laughs> yeah, just go back in time. <laughs> 51 messages following since March. 
Previously subbed for one month. Wait. First message in November. That means they were following for like eight months and then they chatted for the first time. That's crazy. It's not often you see that. Probably a lurker. Okay. First message, November 3rd. Hi, people, hey. Legit just found out I have a sub. Ooh, that is good. That is good because when you give out random gifted subs, then they come in the chat and they're like, oh my god, I got a gifted, and then they watch the stream. Thank you, others. I was lurking out a couple times. Thanks. Oh no, I said I, I, I got it like a week ago. May peace be in you. Oh, Cold of the Lamb. Oh, I remember. This was a sub only Cold of the Lamb. That's why, they, that's why they could watch the stream. A son moment. <laughs> Lamel. Wait, did they. They only chatted during the sub only stream. Lamel. I mean, that's fine. Interesting. This is like. Just based on like how they're chatting. They, they are using 7 TV emotes, which is a good chatter. I love the extension users. I think they're good. Emote spam? Oh, this was... Oh, this is our probably sing a song. A song watcher? Yeah, we, I, I can love the song. I've watched nearly a thousand hours and I feel sad. Okay. They were good. They chatted for... Wow, they were there for two and a half hours. That's a long time to stay for your first ever stream that you, like, chatted. Two and a half hours. To hold somebody for that long is impressive in my opinion. Because I think... Okay. Kaleem is good. Kaleem is good chat. Good chat. Because something that I'm trying to figure out is how to retain viewership. Because I usually peak in my first hour, but then I drop and I can't hold the viewers. So it's like, how do I fix that? I think that's why um, a lot of people will have like the main part of their stream be near the end. But I usually do it near the start because I, I just like to get into it. We have Kalima. Good chatter. Next, we have Rainy, who skipped the line. Let's see if Rainy has said anything sus. 900 plus messages following since October 18th. Sub for nine months. Now, it's not often we see Rainy chat, even though they have so many messages. She pops in sometimes. I know she lurks. She tells me she lurks all the time. I was really sweet and happy. I was like, oh. <laughs> Let's pray a bit. Peace I to pray. <laughs> Just the amount of punches. Yeah, I know you love emotes. You Asterisk, I love Megan's emotes. Get it right. Now, Rainy is good. You know why? She says nice things, she emote spams, and she lurks. All three lovely things. Best emotes on Twitch. She hypes me up with my emotes. We love that. When Megan liked your tweet live, Kappa. Oh, dude, I remember this. <laughs> I wrote hi chat on the big. Yeah, because I. I I did a tweet live, and Rainy was like, oh my god, I replied to it, show it on screen. I'm like, no, I'm not showing it on screen. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I remember this day, July 22nd. Uh, man, I opened you, and then I went to make a sandwich, and now I'm sad. Well, I hope you had a good stream. <laughs> so that was a... Uh, 1328. Um, so that must have been like one. I must have ended early that day. 1 30? That's an early end time. That was fucking funny. Because, <laughs> like, I usually keep my chat open for like 30 minutes after I end just in case we have any offliners. And that was just funny. <laughs> yeah. I I'll see you sometimes in offline chat where you just like say one line and then dip. Like, you'll just like emote spam and then leave. <laughs> Yeah, I'm blocked by who? What? Drama? Oh, th I think this is when Rady donated. Oh, cute. 
Okay, Chatters, question. Question. I saw the Twitter tweet and I was like, oh my god, she's live. Do the tw do the go live tweets actually help? Are they good? Because I know Twitch notifications can take a while to go out or be pushed. So do does doing go live tweets help? Okay, it's nice because like Rainy is also a good chatter because she reacts to what's on screen. This is a good chatter. Like they don't necessarily need your direct attention. Right here, evil combo. Wait, and then. Like she will react to what's happening on screen and that's really good. Because that's the type of chat style you see in larger chat rooms. Would be a shame if Megan lost winky face. <laughs> Lumao. I'm trying to find something bad. I want to find some- I don't think Rainy's ever been, like, super sus. Like, she- she's not a simp, but she's not, like, outwardly. <gasps> Wait, Megan, we love you. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay, <laughs> nothing bad. Nothing bad. I just like them because I'm already here. Yeah, Max, always an offline chat. Oh, I thought that was the end. That can't be the end. Cancelled? What did I do? <laughs> My ego gets people to stay, I think. <laughs> people love confident women. Okay, I think Rainy's good. I haven't seen anything bad. And whenever she does come in, it's always positive stuff. And emotes fan. Megan snitching? Nah. I'm on the nicest. Yeah, I think Rainy's good. I think Rainy's nice. But thank you for redeeming, redeeming Rainy. person was in chat the other day. <clears throat> we have Angie. Following since February 19th. <laughs> Another rare case of following for months and then finally chatting. They were following for nine months and then they finally chatted. <laughs> First message. Hi, you look like Rady Rodriguez. <laughs> so, usually anytime I get any type of comment, I'm like, oh, you look like Rainy. I usually delete it because I understand that Rainy doesn't necessarily like the memes that people made about her, and I want to respect that. So I usually delete those comments. <laughs> And then I kind of like, I ignored it because I didn't know if it was a troll. But then I, I opened their account. I was like, whoa, they've been following since February. That's fucking wild. And then they said sorry because I explained it. I was like, oh yeah, I, people usually say that to me and it's annoying. And she's like, oh, sorry. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> uh. I don't remember how I found you, but I follow so many people. I never see you live on my list. Oh. Yeah, that's probably why they never came in a chat. Sad. That's why chatters make sure you have notifications turned on and... Can you still pin your favorite streamer in the following tab? Or did they disable that beta function? I, I don't remember. Or you can just go and type in the search bar your favorite streamer. Like whenever Hassan's live, I just type in Hassan and then I just click on the stream. Or follow their offline socials, so that way you know when they go live. Ooh. Oh, interesting. 
one Autobahn message. Held for swearing. Honestly, I feel like no matter who you vote for, we're still fucked and the system will never change, just my opinion, by the way. True, but that's like a systemic issue that'll take years to redo and fix. Because, like, honestly, voting has minimal impact, but your vote is more impactful when you vote locally. So for, like, your state representatives, your local city officials, that is where you have more impact. So what? in order for change to happen, we need to elect more younger people, more progressive people, because they will actually advocate for the well-being of the population, not Big Corpa. It's because people only assume that voting for the president is, like, the largest thing. Okay, so Angie hasn't been chatting for a while, and just looking at what they're saying, they talk about themselves a lot, and that's fine, because it's always relevant to what we are currently talking about, and that's good. Because the way that I like to interact with chat is, I, I encourage you guys to answer questions, right? But then I kind of work off of that tangent and keep talking about other things. Oh, you write so pretty, by the way. Oh. Okay, they haven't said anything bad. Because the thing that I always get scared of whenever a chatter talks about themselves a lot is whenever they have, like, an opinion that kind of, like, doesn't align with what I think. And the one that kind of gets me all the time. Yeah, I think Angie's good. Angie's good. I think they were in chat the other day. Yeah, during the K-pop stream, so literally two days ago. Anyway, something that is something that I will be firm about if I don't agree with is uh, vaccination. I think it's important to get vaccinated. So if somebody is pressing me on vaccination, then I will press back. Otherwise, I think it's important to respect what other people believe, right? But public health, safety, and vaccination is still something that everyone should agree on but dummy dumbs don't believe. Get vaccinated, get boosted. Okay, next. Ooh, 185, the last person on the list. Hey, <laughs> good. Little Mal, good one, Mal. <laughs> So we have Sorry I'm Reagan following since December 6th. A new follow. Only five messages. <clears throat> Hello. Ray Reagan is fine. Pronouns are she they. We love the NBs. Peace to two smile. I like that one the most. I love that. New chatter. New follower as well. Not often we get new follows. We love the new followers. So, because, like, what I'm trying to do whenever we have a new chatter, I usually open with... Welcome in, what are your pronouns, nicknames? And then I mentioned that we have follow emotes. Because if you have somebody who likes your emotes, they're more likely to chat. And look, they used it. Easy. Imagine, you tell somebody to do something, and they do it. Yeah, a 2013 account. That's kind of... When I see a 2013 account, I get scared. I'm like, this guy has been around for too long. <laughs> Usually the people who unfollow and refollow my channel are the older accounts. Which I don't know why. I assume they're people who just stumble on the Discover tab. I think Ray's good. We don't have enough information to follow, so hopefully they remain good. But I think Ray's good. Yeah, I only found out about Twitch through H3 Podcast, because I remember they used to stream on just Twitch. And then I never used it again until Pandemic. Oh, 90. 
Oh no, the first thing I see, Aurora. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Okay, computer, following since May 1st. They've only chatted in one stream. Following since May 1st, chatted. Oh, so this would have been during a calligraphy stream. 28 messages. What a deal. Chef, market must be down. Sus, lol. Animal Crossing feeling a little too real. What's your favorite Animal Crossing flower? Oh, no. This was during... Oh, this is during May Day. And then my stream crashed. Because there was like an Animal Crossing May Day event. And then I did calligraphy. Not the beef. Hashtag roar. They said roar to wise. Oh, no. What's your zodiac sign? Oh no! <laughs> they already seem funny, yeah, because they chat like you, Crystal. That's why I think they're fucking hilarious. <laughs> oh, happy late birthday. Aww. Oh, I just use it to remember birthdays. That's cute. That's actually cute. Live, laugh, love. What's your favorite color? So, P, E, 4, C, 3, I or 1N underscore 17 is up for grabs. I think we were talking about usernames. Yes, Queen. Pop off. Thank you for your service. Yaz. Wow. <laughs> this is literally crystal. This is literally crystal. Come back, computer. We need another crystal in chat. I think computer is good. If you come back, you are welcome back. <laughs> what if we banned all the naughty chatters? I think that would go crazy. We don't have many naughty chatters. I think we've only had like two or three. Oh yeah, you're right. Like Caspian, you are right. Yeah, definitely more like Caspian now that you say it. Pick hey, next. Interesting. Icy guy. Following since June. Bit. First chat June 9th. One message. You sure you will be okay after the booster shot? I was winded for days after I got mine. Okay. I remember. I saw this message in chat and I thought it was an anti-vax message and I was like, ain't no way we have an anti-vaxxer. But I was winded for days after I got mine. So, phew. They got boosted. We good. Polite, I guess, yeah. I wonder what we were talking about. Yeah, the, yeah, I agree. They're probably just being honest. But that's that's a weird opener for a chat, right? Showing concern, right? And that's, that's all we have. That's all we have. Account created 2012? That's crazy. Because I just assume all the old accounts are like greasy gamers. Right? But 2012. Damn. Okay. Well, they don't have anything bad. They were showing concern after I got my booster. So I think I think they're good. Nothing bad. Just come back to chat. Come back. We need everybody to come back. Because I always get worried whenever I see somebody just type once and then never come back. I'm like, did I do something wrong? Did I say something bad? Okay, next. Oh, I miss this chatter. It's Plip Lip Cup. This person's from TikTok. Because they used to comment on my TikToks all the time. Oh, I miss them. They were so, like, wholesome. I think probably school. Because they only, they've only chatted since summertime. Or they haven't chatted since summer. Following since May 22nd. First chat. 
May 26. Yes, hi. Ah, I'm so excited. 10 seconds. Yes, yes, I'm on TikTok. So close yet so far. Oh, uh, my timbers are shivering. <laughs> Ginger power? What the fuck? Yeah, I agree. It is a great name. It gives you coins if you ground pound? Is that Baxi Gaming? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. This is outrageous. You cheated? I remember this. Okay, this is a marker clip. I literally clipped this. Because I won the race and then they typed, you cheated? And then I clipped that. <laughs> Oh, this is my first stream and I love it. I hope to attend more. Oh. Oh wait, this they were in the starting soon screen. That's why they're saying 10 seconds. Cuz right here, start time at 10. Oh. Oh, this is a tournament stream cuz they're commentating. Yeah, last time chat, June 28th. Um, they never said anything bad, and they used to come on the chicken talks all the time. Come back! Just come back! We miss you! Flip Flip is a good chatter. Good chatter. Interesting. Okay. We have Chickory Hades. This is a friend of Cutie Lee. Following since March? 43 messages. First chat, March 22nd, following the same day. Account created 2012? Oh my god. Of course, they're Cutie Lee sub, of course. Cutie Lee smirk. Is Megan good or is the AI just bad? Goodily smirk, that's so mean. That's good. Hades is a good chatter. They're actually funny. Oh, I think brain freeze. I think that's why we did the Slurpee stream. I've lost everything. I am bankrupt. I will never financially recover. That's probably they probably gambled. I'm selling organs to get more channel points. Nice. The Twitch Mafia at my door. Um, Twitch staff, huh? Oh, that's it. Good stream. Calligraphy is dope. Yeah, they were here for like an hour. Come back, Hades. You were actually funny. But good chatter. Did use Kudalee Smirk too much, though. Okay, I think we'll do chat reviews for like 30 more minutes and then we'll go to the quiz. So if anybody wants to have their name looked at now, use your channel points. That way we have enough time. Because I, I don't know if I want to go through oh, 185. I was trying, but I don't know if I can. Okay, next.
We have Zathron. Following August 2nd. First chat, August 5th. Hi. Okay. Um, not, not much here. What a bad chat. Yeah, they're good lurker, but bad chatter. <laughs> uh, I think just by saying hi, is that probably didn't answer your nickname question? True. True. Or maybe they got scared. Because, like, I know some people for stream content, they don't like being, like, talked to directly. That's why some people don't like the vibe of smaller streamers. So just, just hi. Does that mean they're good? They did greet by saying hi. They didn't start off saying something sus, right? I, I think they default to good. Also, since we're going to be reviewing the quiz answers in about 30 minutes, please make sure, if you haven't already, make sure you take the quiz. It takes less than five minutes. They should have said hello. <laughs> Why are you grilling them for being not casual? Kind of cringe, not gonna lie. I wish we could see Lemon's first message. Ooh, interesting. Oh, wow. Tanuki Mario Nightmare. Known in this chat for being a sweat. Following since May 29th. Tier 1 for 4 months gifted, probably. Only 161 messages. I know Tanuki's a lurker. They usually lurk occasionally. 529. Hiya, I'm up for some no item racing. You know what happened? Because this May, May was the first month where I used hashtags for the tournament streams. And I think May was the month where we had a lot of sweats come in. Because I used I used hashtag tournament for the stream. Because that's when um, tags were more popular in the search bar. So that's how Tanuki found the channel, I think. Yeah, they, they were ready to go. <laughs> yeah, see, look. Like, I know Tanuki shows up for most of the tournaments, and that's fine. You know, people have their own favorite content. But you know, they lurk. June 7th. Said hi at 11. Left stream at 13.07. So... They enjoy some of the other content. Oh, right here. July 5th. Hi, Meg. Wishing you the best of luck in your quest. Yay! Try Yoshi. All right. Well done. Gotta go. Thanks for streaming. Yeah, so they, they watch some of the normal streams as well. And they're always, like, super nice and encouraging, too. They do banter a little bit during the tournament. But either way, they're super nice. Super nice. I think Tanuki is, like, one of the more wholesome chatters. They don't get salty when we brag for beating them. Yeah, they were actually super nice last month. <laughs> I mean, the only thing that could have been snarky would have been like, I just don't know these courses yet. <laughs> but Tanuki is good. Very good. Um, talking about being good, if you are a good chatter and you want to get onto possibly the, ni the nice list, um, follow the channel. If you follow the channel, you get cool emotes and... You get to type in chat. Wowee. And if you're already following, make sure your notifications turn on. That way you get notified when I go live. I want to see patch and coat. I mean, if they come in, otherwise it's all random. That way it's fair. Or you can skip the line. <gasps> no way. I was hoping we would get this person today. No way. Because I, I know they're going to watch the VODA later. We have Wov. Oh my god. I try not to play favorites, but it's always a pleasure when I'm, whenever Wolf comes in. Oh. Okay, where are they? 
following since June 29th. Tier 1 for 6 months. Oh. Wolf is a good chatter. They're always a pleasure. Um, I don't think Wolf has said anything bad or said anything to make me uncomfortable. They, they, I don't, cause like whenever I have a negative interaction with a chatter, I remember it. It sticks with me. But Wolf has never done anything bad. Ah, oh, the the misfits meta get fired up. <laughs> so stupid. <laughs> Oh, this was- may I- may I give you a tip or a hint? See, Wolf knows the rules. Oh, and then I would- I kind of like encourage him to buy the Cult of the Lamb game. Okay, so like, I saw the VOD for the Candy Tier List stream, and like, I agree for Reese's getting F tier. Best chatter. Everybody was giving me shit. For rating Reese's F tier. That saves you, Wolf. That saves you. But I think Wolf is definitely one of my favorite chatters. And if you're watching the VOD back later, clip this and save it for whenever you're sad. Because you are appreciated here, Wolf. And they're so cute because they will like clip the VODs too. Oh, they're so cute. Reese's is default F tier good. I agree. I agree. Yeah, because I know Wolf has school, so they can't really watch as much, but they usually can watch evening streams. Wait, how is this allowed? Wait, what? How is that allowed? That actually changes loads. Honestly, I thought it was educational, to be honest. I think the sweats come out at night. Oh, it must have been I did a trick in, like, Fall Guys or some shit. Do not subscribe! Do not spend money here! I do not agree. Shut up, Mac. <laughs> do you believe tarot cards and crystal boosts are real? <laughs> Oh yeah, I was- I, the, for this stream I was like, guys, you need to give me topics. I need questions. And they were like, actually giving questions. <laughs> I look, you miss Fall Guys streams? I don't. I would get so fucking mad if I didn't win. Cause I felt bad. My rod broke, huh? <laughs> oh wait, was this the fishing tourney? Ah. <laughs> Isn't the red markings blood? No, it's paint, it's paint. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. What was a good chatter? Good chatter. Ooh, number 19. Ooh. We have I am JF Downs. This is a streamer friend. Downs was actually my first ever sub. Because I can't remember. Oh, they found me on the Twitch Discover tab because you know my game overlay? The one where it has like the game over here and then face cam here and then like the, the leaf border. I remember. <clears throat> right here. I was searching for new streamers I have not seen before, but I think I would enjoy. So I searched Minecraft as one of my favorite games, and then your preview looked really interesting. You have a very clean overlay. So Downs actually found me on Discover, and they are a super nice, super bubbly um, streamer from the UK. <laughs> oh, this was when I was doing challenge streams as well. You know, whenever Downs comes into the chat, they are fairly active.
Are you retiring already? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> what? Oh, no. Yeah, it seems like Downses will chat during like the the big event streams because this is for the stream anniversary subathon. What was August fourth? I don't know what August fourth stream was. And then eleven twenty three. I'm moving. It hooks you in. Now that is a real pun. It's so funny because they put like exclamation points and it's really cute. Yeah, Downs is a good chatter. We don't see them often, but they're always good. Super positive too. run into them yeah they don't come into chat often it's because like they're in the uk so time zones is the main thing number 16 Ooh, interesting. a lot of these older chatters i haven't seen in a long time okay we have juicy doodles following since january 18th 132 messages Chatted the same day they followed. What was I doing in January? This was right before I was affiliate. Because I think I had affiliate like the very end of January. Like the final week. Oh wowie! Hi! Anything is fine really. I'm not fussed in that regards. Are you excited for Haunted Chocolatier? Oh, this was when I must have been doing Stardew Valley. Because they're talking about, like, modding the game. Yeah, I think they said later that they are actually studying game dev. I'm going to college for game design. I remembered. And went to college already for animation, so I don't have to imagine. Yeah, so then they're, then they're talking about, like, game dev stuff. <laughs> Did he really just ask the man in a wheelchair to turn around? <laughs> Yeah, because one of the characters in Stardew was in a wheelchair, and then the doctor probably, like, asked him to, like, do shit. <laughs> oh, and then they're talking about drama with their old doctor? I wonder where they are now. I think they've come in chat somewhat recently. <laughs> Dude, this is literally- I have stalker potential without the stalker animation. This is what I was talking about yesterday. Like, I'm crazy, but I don't act on it. <laughs> oh. oh my god. I hope they're successful. Yeah, I wonder if they've made anything. Oh, and then they're talking about fishing. I'm 6'2"? Dude, that's crazy. <laughs> Discord's down and they said people are promoting their tokens in the trending tab. They don't have many messages, but they're all kind of hefty. Because that's kind of the vibe you get when you have like one to three viewer streams. Is you're having like full on conversations with the chatters. And it's not that I don't like that vibe, but I feel like it's not as entertaining for the whole collective viewer base. Wait, the last time they chatted was February. No way. Okay, well, they were good. Very chatty, like very talkative. But like I said, that's the kind of the vibe you get with low viewer count streams. I mean, I'm still a low viewer count too. Like, I average like five. But when you hit that like one to three viewer, that's when you get like full on conversations. It, it was like interesting reading through it. But the thing that I kind of don't like about that type of vibe is that like, chat fully leads the conversation. And it's kind of hard to like form your own commentary style. That's why like, I don't rely too heavily on 
reading chat too much. Like, I, I try and do more back and forths. Like, I don't like when chat carries a conversation. Oops, I'm sorry. No, you're fine, Mac. Mac, you definitely help when there's lulls. Like, lulls in conversation, I mean. So you're fine. It's just... If I'm watching back of VOD and I can't think of topics of my own to talk about and I'm just talking about whatever chat's talking about, then to me that's a problem. Because how are you going to be able to stand on your own if you don't have a chat room? That's why a lot of non-affiliate channels don't ever succeed. It's because they can't stand on their own. Next! Oh, I have no clue who this is. Who Megalon? Um, Hitomi's... I don't know. Okay. Following since May 25th. First chat message, May 25th. Only six messages. Period. Bob. Yes. Do you listen to K pop? And then next chat, two months later in July. Peace I to love. Period. <laughs> We need you to come back! But that was nice. They're like reacting to what's on screen. That's a good style of chat. <laughs> yeah, so they're good. They're good. And they did use Peace I Too Love. That's a good opener. <laughs> come back! Everybody needs to come back! I want to get a bad chatter. I purposely removed anybody that I've had to ban, but I want some bad chatters. Everyone's nice. Yeah, it's because I make sure you guys are nice. And if you aren't nice, then you get clapped. What? What is the music? I'm Super Smash. Okay, well this person must have changed their username last night because I can't find it. I can't hear the music, so I hope it's good. Ooh, number 11. No way, number 11 was rainy, which we already did. <laughs> They're hiding from me? Maybe. I don't know. What? Why is this one not coming up either? Oh, okay. It's working. So that person must have changed their name then. Ain't no way. Because it literally worked at 10 p.m. last night. Okay. We have Lord of Dead. 42 messages following since May 30th. First chat message July 5th. So they waited two months. <laughs> sort of why it's a lame moment to SMH they stole Isabel from Mario Kart not gonna lie I'm not a big fan of watching streams but you're like the only streamer I like watching ain't no way you're lying <laughs> oh my god girl version of Puck baking stream but people oh my god yes not the text delay making me look like a what huh what Oh, baking! Oh. 
They're talking about the... Anyway! <laughs> uh, awkward. I blame Charles Darwin. Me too. Pineapples and mushrooms for me. Yes, I love pineapple and pizza. How does that correlate? Um, because I think I was talking about being burned alive or cooked in my room. And they were making it a joke that un uh, unintentionally alluded to, like, the... Yeah. <laughs> anyway... I'd eat Ohio because who wouldn't? Oh, definitely. Ohio would taste good but have really large chunks of Walmart or something. I don't know. This is kind of random to say, but do you ever stream Pokemon? <laughs> okay, this guy seems like the definition of, like, lol random. <laughs> uh... <laughs> Hi, bestie! <laughs> I think it's cute when people call strangers bestie. Oh, this was a, um, what you call it? This is when I ate Burger King. The, uh, Bowser's Fury stream. Spoiler warning, but I married Bowser at the end. Oh my god, we are still discussing Burger King from the Crumble Cookie stream. Oh my god, here comes the part where Bowser and I marry each other. My favorite is stab aesthetic Magnum. <laughs> yeah i agree they're they're like asbian <laughs> i mean they said i'm their favorite streamer to watch so you know come back come back come back <laughs> lord of dead come back Okay, we probably have time for like three more. So if you want to redeem and get onto the nice list, you have to skip the line now. I know we've, I'm going to switch to full cam for a second. I know we have some people who might be watching, like lurking. Don't be scared to skip the line. Not gonna lie, I would skip the line. Okay, next. Catching fire. Falling since May 14th. 12 messages. Oh, first time chat June 11th. So they waited a month. Hello! I prefer he, him, and usually go by catching fire or catching fire. Or catching or fire? What? Everybody always leaves out the three. Yeah, because it makes no sense. <laughs> yes, it is. Everybody always asks that lol. I made this name for Minecraft when I was like 13 or so, and I eventually stuck his username for basically everything. Literally. Account made in 2015. So that means they're in their late 20s. Oh yeah, I also found you in Hover. What? <laughs> we hate Hover. Pepe spit Hover. Binge. I have a question about a rule. Can I complain about ads if it's about what an ad is? Like, not go bit about there being ads, but just in general, but just a specific ad I got? What is that? Um, Hover is like a niche app where people post Twitch clips, and it's alright. People are indifferent about it. I'm definitely indifferent about it. I'm Google it. Um, got it. I like your island too. Mine is just Pokemon Center song backwards. What about my mom? What about your mom jokes? You know, like Muscle Man does. They were in chat for like 10 minutes. Not even 10 minutes. 1816. And then 1823. Not even 10 minutes, but they were really active for that. N less than 10 minutes. But they haven't come back. Hmm. If anybody doesn't know what Hover is, it's. It's marketed as like a gaming clip app, but it's usually used for like Twitch streamers to network and it's cringe. But I still post on it, just in case the app pops off one day. They didn't really do anything. Yeah, it's fine. The only thing I don't like is Hover. Cringe. <laughs> because what will happen is how Hover the UI is, is whenever somebody's live, it automatically links or puts a link to your Twitch stream 
on your profile and then people can click on the link. So what happens is people come into your chat and be like, oh my God, I found you on Hover and then leave. And it's, it's cringe. It, it's, it's used to network and it's disingenuous and fake as fuck. So if ever I see somebody from Hover, I'm just like, ugh. Ugh. Pepe spit Hover. <laughs> but I still use it. Like I still post on it, but I don't engage with anybody on it. Anyway, I think they're fine. Nothing bad. But they haven't come back, so come back. Cause see how they said they're like, oh, I'm from Hover, and then they never come back. Chat a little bit. Spend 10 minutes, hopefully. Cause what, it's very much like follow for follow vibes on the app or on the platform, and that's why I don't like it. Okay, next. Oh, oh, oh. Are you gonna skip the line or are you just gonna cross your fingers that you get picked? You've been here all stream, huh? Or do you not wanna be on the list at all? Do you want do you wanna like not expose your logs? Is that it? Oh we had Angie already did Angie. Huh? I'm getting repeat numbers. This is bullshit. Random number generator. Will I not get picked? Well, we only have time for like two more. So you might not, because we've only done like 30 names out of 185. Yeah, it's random. Now, did you not read the pinned message? Come on. Because this stream is for like the regular viewers, because obviously if people chat and don't come back, then they're probably never coming back. <laughs> Honestly. When I may have to waste- Would you really waste your channel points? If you don't get on the nice list, then what are you gonna do? You're gonna get coal. You know, this list is going directly to Santa. I'm gonna overnight ship it to him. <laughs> Clueless. <laughs> <laughs> Gaming Panda 59 following since May 29th. Followed and then chatted instantly. Only one message. Hi, I came from TikTok. Wowee. <laughs> well, you know how I talked about earlier? It's cringe when people are like, oh, I'm from this app or I'm from Instagram. It's used as like networking, but I think this person's genuinely a viewer because look, they don't have a profile pic. This is probably genuinely a Twitch watcher. So, I think they're good. We like the TikTok frogs. We need more followers, guys. <laughs> like, I don't know if any of you guys remember, but there was somebody who came in the chat and their first message was like, Oh, I sent you a message. And I want to do a collab. And it's just like, that's cringe. Why, why the fuck are you doing that? It was like months ago. Probably in May, I think. And I didn't open that DM. Because that's weird. It's probably scat. Don't you usually ask, though? Oh, true. But that was their first ever chat. So that means I've never, quote-unquote, met them or seen them in the chat before, and they open with that. So, like, the best, like, opener is, like, they say hi, I ask them their nickname, and then I ask, well, where'd you come from? Or use the follower email, so it's either those options. Okay, next, we have Kobobo. Thank you for skipping the line. I promise you, you're not going to waste your channel points. Okay, we have Kobobo following since June 22nd. Tier 1 for 5 months. <laughs> Peace I too. This is from the other day. Safety number one party. I've never heard of somebody having a mask while making food. The red people, peace I to sneaker. <laughs> Lamel. <laughs> red flag if you can't wash hands. True. True. Sag, not two cameras. I don't. Okay, so Kobobo watches basically every stream, similar to Mac. Sometimes they're an off. <laughs> what is what is this? What is this? 
sometimes they um, will be an offline chat for a little bit after I end or like a little bit before I start. I love making paper snowflakes. There's a fun website to make paper snowflakes. It's so fun online and no mess. <laughs> I love giving you guys that voice because I just imagine. I know that's not how you guys sound, but it's, it's so fun to me. <laughs> make VIP 1 million piece I 2 shake. Never. Never. Ain't no way. It's like normal messages and then emote wall. <laughs> I think Kobobo started chatting at the very beginning of fall. Because I think they said that they've gotten gifted a few times and that they lurk sometimes, but they only started really actively chatting in the fall time. I can't scroll up that far because this is from like a week ago. 12, 6. Two weeks ago, rather. Give it to the poor! Fucking socialist. We hate them. <laughs> Just leave stream up for 24 hours so I can farm channel points. True. Should we do another subathon? Type 1? Another emote wall? PSA 2 collapse. You don't want me to do another subathon? What? Huh? You guys don't want a subathon? You guys don't want me to make money and leech off of your guys' low income? <laughs> Not this year, next year. I mean, we might do it again for our stream anniversary. Yeah, I don't think we're ever going to get to the beginning of Kobo's logs. Over a thousand. I can never contribute and get sad. That's how I feel, too. Like... I need to start, like, cutting back on what I'm spending, because since I don't have, like, any income now, besides stream, like, I can't be spending, like, I can't afford to drop, like, five, ten bucks. Like, when I went to my doctor's visit, I was looking for it all day, because, oh, wait, did the music stop? When the music stops. Oh, it's Minecraft. Um... Because there was, like, a bubble tea shop that was, like, a block away from the doctor's office, and I was, like, looking forward to it all day. But, um, I was like, you know, I really shouldn't spend $5 on a bubble tea now. Because, like, whenever I go, I always have, like, 5-10 bucks. So, was, in my head, I was like, I was going to spend, like, 15 bucks. So, I was like, yeah, I should not spend $15. And I was sad because it sucks when you get used to, like, being able to, like, have luxuries or buy little treats for yourself. But I just need to stop. <laughs> I, I can't afford it. And I, I don't want people to feel bad. Because that's just how life is going to be for a while. Like, granted, my sister is being very supportive. She she was bummed that my disability got denied, but she, she figured that was what was going to happen. So it's fine. <laughs> Whack declined VIP. Sad not having four people. <laughs> Yeah, I think Kobobo's pretty good. I don't think Kobobo's ever done anything, like, out of line. Yeah, I don't think Kobobo's done anything crazy. <laughs> like I said earlier, if somebody does something bad, I will remember it. I think the one crazy thing they did do was they, in one month, they gifted, like, more than 25 subs. It was crazy. It was, like, 30-something. It was crazy. You better not do that shit again, unless you become a millionaire. And that's fine. I have a gift for you. Your mom was plenty enough. <laughs> You'll pop off next year and get creator of the year? Nah, 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 nah. No way. Ain't no way. Ain't no way. That, that would never happen. Yeah, I have a gift for chat tomorrow as well. I mean, it's something small, but you'll see. Get fired up! <laughs> but thank you, Mac. That's cold. It's called comedy. You know what else is funny? Oh, wait. Kobobo's a good chatter. Kobobo's a good chatter. You know what else is funny? Running ads. Because chatters, we are another hour in the stream, so it's time for me to run some ads. You can avoid that ad by subscribing 
for four ninety nine, just five dollars. Keep your coffee and get ad free viewing. This is from the table. I promise. I have my arm resting on it. Um, you can avoid that ad by subscribing for four ninety nine, just five dollars. Keep your coffee and get ad free viewing all month long. Or you can link your Amazon Prime to your Twitch and hashtag sub for free with Prime. Click subscribe. See if you have a Prime available. Um, yeah. After the ad. If anybody else wants to skip the line, I will do it right now. If not, then we're going to go over the quiz results. So if you have to watch that ad and you haven't filled out the quiz, make sure you do it right now. And anyway, after the ad, we will look at the quiz results. That was terrible. It wasn't that bad. It wasn't that bad. Okay, Kobobo, good chatter. I should purposely time out people throughout next year just for fun that way when we do log reviews again you can see how bad you guys are should we do this next year like do all the people we didn't do this year like let's see how many names we've actually done we have two three oh wait I have to actually count because some of you guys skipped I enjoy it. Good. Oh, there's so many people of logs that I wanted to look at. Sad. I would go longer, but I can't today. I mean, we're gonna do it's probably gonna be another hour for the quiz, so don't worry, stream's not over yet. Uh, I wanted to show Scootish's logs. <laughs> We'll see another time. Another time. Maybe we can continue this tomorrow. Because we have some time to fill tomorrow. Because we're going to be doing Santa Watch, so I have a few things on the list. This was a lot more wholesome than I thought it was going to be. Yeah, because I, I purposely took out the people who were actually bad. I purposely removed them from my list because they are not a part of the stream if they're bad. What time will that be? I think I'm going to start streaming at like 3 or 4 p.m. my time tomorrow. We could do sub only, but then it'd kind of defeat the point. Because if it's sub only, then I'd have to delete the buff. Can I look at this one? No, I didn't. So maybe we can do this a little bit tomorrow. I thought the stream was just going to be making fun of chat. Isn't that what I kind of did, though? I did not do a lot of names. That took a long time. Some of my favorite streams that I see larger streamers do is the ban appeals. I think it's funny. Like, seeing people's, like... Justifications for their messages is hilarious to me. And I didn't realize how long it could take. Because essentially what we're doing is like ban appeals. But not people who have gotten banned. I did not realize it would take this long. I mean, granted, if I were doing this offline, like without commentary, I could speedrun. Okay. Oh, I wanted to do Peason's biggest fan. Damn. Granted, these were all randomly, so I did not pick and choose who I, who I picked. So, we did two, three, five, eight, eleven, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty, twenty-two, twenty-four, twenty-six, twenty-seven, 28, 30, 32, 34, 37. We did 38 reviews to them. Not even... That's not even, not even a quarter of the whole amount. It's crazy. Yeah, we'll do some more tomorrow. But, ugh, do my foot, my foot. Okay. Let's look at the list. Now I can't cut the paper because we're gonna do some more tomorrow. But let's look at this. And we have three bad shadows. 
Three bad chatters. Look at this. Look at all these names. Okay, wait. I gotta... Shit. Because it, it's on... It's on a roll of paper. I think it's kind of weird to think about. Because even though... We went through like 30 plus names today. To think that I possibly made an impact on this many people. <laughs> it's not all gonna show. There we go. That is our list so far. Look at the three red names. Everybody else was nice, but we had Mix, Rex, and Titans for Naughty Chatters so far. <laughs> okay, cool. Very nice. Very fun. I have helped Santa a lot. I've saved him three, three hours of his time. Okay. We might do some more reviews tomorrow. But you know what time it is now? Y'all know what time it is now? It is time for the Naughty or Nice quiz results. Okay, so we're not doing the logs anymore. Gotta change your title. So have you been naughty or nice? Final results. So you guys have had a little under two weeks to fill out the Naughty or Nice quiz. I'm going to pause responses because you guys had ample time to fill this out. Cool, we did not get any bad submissions. <laughs> I was worried. I was worried that I was going to get like a spam bot or something but they're all good we are good i copied off of someone who did you cheat off with i need to know that way i can cross them off the nice list tell me if you guys cheated your super report your super your self-reporting okay so i have to take the quiz myself I am on an incognito tab so you guys cannot see. Get fucked. So, I copied off of Lemon. Dude. <laughs> guys, stop, stop. Stop it. You guys are ruining the fun. Okay. So, final results. Have you been naughty or nice this year? Peace, I too. Smile. Answers will collectively be shown on stream during Peace and 17's Naughty or Nice holiday stream. So answer truthfully and honestly. This is all for fun, so don't feel too bad if you haven't been a goody two-shoes. Lamau. Now everybody did fill this out properly, so thank you. What's your Twitch username? <laughs> um, Peace in 17, obviously. Now this will give you guys some insight on how I conduct myself as well. I'm not going to submit my answer. Because, what's the point? Um, do you hold the door open for others? I like to watch the door slam in their face. Yes, sometimes, but not always, or never. So, when you're answering these questions, it's kind of like if there were a person there. So, if there were a person at the door behind me, I would always hold the door open for them. I'm not a fucking psycho, okay? It doesn't matter if they're a child or a grandma, I'll still hold the door open for them. So that's the nice thing to do. And I would not like if somebody slammed the door in my face. Because you want to treat others how you want to be treated. Do you volunteer? Nope. I, <laughs> I used to in high school and that's how I got my first job. But ever since then, I, I, I just don't feel like volunteering because I feel like a lot of jobs that require volunteering, they should be paying the people. Like... Obviously, there's people on this app that get paid. Like, why are you exploiting? Uh. 
it just feels weird to where I feel like people should be compensated for their time. Like, I understand doing it out of the goodness of your heart, but it, if you're dedicating like 20 to 30 hours, oh, so, sorry, if you're doing like 10 hours a week, like two hours a day for five days, that's like a part-time job. Like, it's different if, if it's for like a non-profit, but like, it, the idea of volunteering, it just seems so icky to me. I don't know. Yeah, I had to do mandatory volunteering for high school graduation. Like, you had to do like 20 hours. And I volunteered with the church's daycare, and that was fine. That's so why I got a job afterwards. But, um, it just feels weird. I don't know. Anyway, do you pre rinse your dishes? Yes, I'm not a crazy person. I do the dishes, so why would I not pre rinse? Motherfuckers who eat rice and do not pre-rinse the dish after? I hate you. Moving on. Do you put your shopping cart in the rack or leave it in the parking lot when you're done? I've told this many times, but if I see a shopping cart that is in my path to get to the cart that is not inside the rack, I will grab it as well with my cart. So sometimes I will push three carts together and put them in the rack. Because I understand that when people don't put shopping carts in the rack, you're making it harder for the worker. And the worker should not have to do that extra work. It doesn't matter if you think you are making them keep their job. The reason why there are shopping cart racks is obviously to make the, the cart rack person's job easier. And also to make sure that the parking lot is safe to drive in. Like you should not have debris or obstacle driving or blocking parking spots or in the fucking road. Common sense. I put it in the rack. I'm not psycho. I'm using psycho a lot and I don't mean to be toxic. It's just, it's, I hate people who don't have common courtesy. When I was making this quiz, I was Googling what are common courtesy things. And I got a list of like a hundred things. I could have made this quiz longer, but I wanted to keep it to like less than 20 questions. In public, do you listen to music or videos with headsets on or play it so everybody can hear? Now, this one was tricky for me because back in, like, early middle school, I was not allowed to use headsets. My mom would not buy me a pair. So, when I would walk to school, I would listen to mu my music from my phone in my pocket super loud. Um, so, I don't do that anymore because I have headsets. But the, I would have used headsets if I was allowed to buy a pair myself. And once I was able to buy a pair, then I used headsets. Why? Because they're crazy. Anyway, <laughs> yes, I use headsets now, because I am reformed, I am better, I have changed. Now remember, for all these questions, you picture if there's another person there. If there is a jar of candy with one piece of chocolate left, do you offer it to the other person or take it first without asking? I ask first, because I am bigger, I don't need more chocolate. And if I swipe that chocolate first, the other person's gonna think I'm fat. I'm being honest, I'm being honest, insecure for one second, back to being commonly courteous. It's not nice, like it's just, it's just nice to offer first, even if you want to eat it yourself, just offer it anyway, because you don't want the other person to think they're gonna like, oh, they just took the chocolate without asking. That's so mean. Like you don't want to plant that seed in their head. If you, need to plan, if you need to cancel plans, do you tell the person you can't go in advance or wait till the last minute and flake without telling them? This depends. I will admit I'm a flake, but I usually give ample time before I flake. It's because I get in my own head thinking that oh this person doesn't like me or they don't want to do the project with me and I don't I don't I sometimes I feel like I can't commit to like putting the time and or effort into something but I usually don't cancel last minute so I've gotten a lot better about expressing my own personal boundaries when it comes to my time my work my effort and I don't flake as much anymore, I think. 
Because when I say flaking, granted, I was worse a year ago, is what I'll say. Because, like, let's say this wasn't school, but if I had, like, a project that I wanted to work on and I didn't complete it, I would just either leave the group project. This isn't school, this is, like, just other fun stuff. Because um, I remember I had two friends from high school that I hadn't talked to for, like, years after graduating, and then they reached out to me. And they were like, hey, can you do art for a project? And I was like, cool, I can do that. And then I kind of ghosted them because what they wanted was, like, too much for me. Like, they wanted me to, like, design, um, what you call it? Like, D&D characters? Like, do a whole D&D art book, basically. And I agreed to it, and then a week later, I was like, no, I can't do it. It's too much. Um, and that, that's the one thing I think about. And I feel bad, but I've gotten better at expressing my boundaries and not to agree to projects if I feel like I can't handle it. I feel like you should have made the questions multiple choice. This is not critique time! <laughs> but I could not do open-ended questions for all these because I'm not combing through 20 plus open ended. That's dumb. Anyway. Uh, multiple choice is easier to determine if you answered right or not. Okay. Have you ever yelled at a service worker? No. Yes, I'm ashamed of it, or yes, I'm proud of it. I have never yelled at a service worker. I've never yelled in public. Because to me, in order for you to muster up the courage to yell at someone, you have to think that that person is lesser than you. You have to think that that person is deserving to be screamed at. And I don't think anybody should be yelled at. Like, I'm fine with being firm with people. Like, okay, I'm sounding very firm right now. Like, this is my this is my my nagging, stern voice I'm using right now. Um, but I will never yell at somebody. The only time I've ever yelled was when I worked at the daycare. Because I was trained to scream and yell at the children. Which, looking back, was, like, very unethical. Granted, I did not receive any good training at that workplace. But, you know, it's fine. That's in the past. That was when I was in high school. And then the other time I yelled at somebody was my sister because she almost started a fire in her room. And I screamed at her. I was like, what the fuck are you doing? But really loud. Uh, yeah, the daycare was not good. <laughs> uh, anyway, so I would never yell at somebody. I would never. Because like just experiencing so much of that myself, I don't want to inflict that on anybody else. Yeah, yelling in public is cringe. Like you ever see the Karens who like film themselves being like absolutely psychotic? And they think they're in the right. <laughs> it's so funny. It's so funny. Okay. Do you double text if they don't reply in less than eight hours? Now, this is something that I've changed as well. The reason why I put if they don't reply in less than eight hours is because theoretically that's a work day, right? Like, let's say, for example, your friend or your partner's at work. Do you double text them if they don't reply right away? Knowing that they're at work. So if somebody's at work, or if I know they're doing something, I usually don't double text. Because um, to me, double text means like, oh, if I text somebody, hey, you want to get lunch, and then they don't reply, and then I reply with, hey, did you get my message? To me, that's what double texting is. To me, double texting is when you refer to the previous message in your text. I think that is bad. Because if somebody doesn't want to talk to you, they don't want to talk to you. Like, don't pressure them indirectly to, like, keep talking to you. The only time I will double text, like if I'm, uh, like, let's say I text my friend in the morning and I'm like, oh, I did this last night. And then at like 2 p.m. I bake cookies and I send the pictures of cookies. Like that to me is fine because you're talking about something else. But also I don't blow up people's phones. Like I, I get, I feel so bad because like on Messenger, when you send somebody a picture, it sends them the picture and then the caption separately. So it looks like you texted them twice. And I hate that because... I do not like checking my messages and seeing that I have like 10 missed text messages from somebody because that freaks me out. I think they're dying. <laughs> um, so in my head, I don't double text. Like there was one time, or like my parents, they double text all the time and it's fucking annoying. Like if I don't reply in like five minutes, they're like, hey, did you get my text? And it's like, I was doing other shit. But I, I don't double text. 
It kind of nags me when I tell somebody something and they never respond and then I would proceed to do something without acknowledging what I said. That's kind of, that's kind of what I do too. If Rainy's in chat, you can, you can tell me that I do that shit. It's because if I see like three messages from somebody and they're all talking about three different things, I'll talk about the thing that I feel like I can give my most input on. Like if I get a text about like cupcakes, rainbows, and then unicorns, but I know the most about unicorns, I'll talk about the unicorn text message. But not the other two. I don't know. It's just like, I get overwhelmed by conversations in general. So like, if I have too many topics at once, I'm just like, I can't handle it. I don't know. But granted, this is like with friends and stuff. And like, my friends know this for the most part. So they know not to like, make me lose my mind. Okay. This one was interesting. Because I was looking at answers throughout. This one was interesting. If someone doesn't reply to your text, do you call them right after? No, I'm not psychotic, okay? If you be calling people right after they don't reply to your text, you need to calm down. Because, to me... Now, in middle school, I used to do this. Because I was in fucking middle school, okay? I did not understand social etiquette. I have a distinct memory for this one friend. This is a friend... They had recently moved to town. They only lived in town for like two months and then they moved away. And once they moved away, I remember, oh, dude, I was fucking crazy in middle school. By crazy, I mean like I did not understand anything when it came to like social normalities. So I remember one night, I forgot that she had like a band recital. Um, and she wasn't answering my text messages because I was like talking to her about something random. And then I spammed her phone with like different emojis. But instead of sending them separately, I would send, like, a 50-character message with, like, 50 different emojis. And I did that, like, three times. And then I called her seven times back-to-back. -back. I didn't know- cause, Okay, I was fucking stupid, okay? I was in middle school. I was 13. I didn't know any better. And after that, I looked back at it, like, a week later. I was like, that was fucking crazy. And she didn't really talk to me after that. <laughs> Cause she called me after the recital like ended. She's like, yeah, I was I was playing the fucking flute. I was like, oh, I didn't know. <laughs> yeah, so that was in middle school. I have reformed. I don't do that shit anymore, okay? I'm like you, Mac. Like, if I want to call somebody, I'll text them first if it's like a friend. Cause if I get a if I call somebody unprecedented, then it's like an emergency. I usually don't call people. I. The only person I call is, like, my best friend. But I haven't talked to them in, like, three weeks, because they've been working super late, so... <sighs> Have you lied this year? Yeah, obviously. I feel like you have to lie. And even little white lies can count. Little things count. They fucking lie. Everybody lies, okay? Don't don't lie if you have the mind. Have you donated to charity? Yes. <laughs> Streamers and churches do not count. Yes. The only time I really donated to charity was if there's like a charity stream, I'll do I'll drop like twenty bucks. Um, I I would love to like donate to charities on my own, but I always feel like. It, it's weird because during like massive donation campaigns like you see for streams or um, like YouTubers do, I feel like they have more impact because it seems like it's a larger donation sum at once. Like me donated in like $10 to whatever charity by myself, it doesn't feel like it has a lot of impact. I do donate to Planned Parenthood whenever I go. I usually donate like 5 to 20 bucks. Because what's cool... Um, I'm on birth control. Wow, Depo. Wowie. Women's health. Um, what's cool is that they have, like, a little placard right next to, like, the, the, the desk. And they say, oh, this donation does this. $5 does this. $20 does this. And it tells you what your donation could theoretically buy. And I think that's cool. Um, anyway. Because, like, it, I think that's different because that's a service that I actually use. You know, I, fee I, I would love to donate money to puppies, but it's like, I don't have a puppy and I don't... I don't know. It's just like, uh... <laughs> it, it's hard because there's so many things I want to support, but I I can't. And I feel bad if I pick just one thing. I don't know. 
Do you follow Peace and Seventeen on Twitter? Yes, of course. That's myself. How can I not follow myself? I follow my, because <laughs> I have two accounts that are considered alts. I have Peace and Seventeen Clips, and then Peace and Art on both IG and Twitter, and they only follow my accounts. So, yeah. So, Let let's look through. Okay, so that was my answers to the quiz. So let's go ahead and look at your guys's. <laughs> Peace I do, snicker. Okay. So. You guys saw how I answered. No, I do not like my own tweets. The only time I liked my own tweet was when I was replying to Cutely one time. And I liked my reply on both my alt accounts. And then she replied to it, not you liking it with your alt. Skull emoji, and then I never did it again. We had 24 responses. That's a good handful. Looking at my viewer count, looking at my follower count, 24 is more than I was expecting. I was expecting 10. So, claps and chat for everybody who took the time to fill this out. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you for helping for the stream bit. So, it said total points for the quiz 13, but uh, it don't matter. We're just doing this for fun. So we're gonna go through. Uh, <laughs> Rico only missed questions. Momo. Okay, so I just wanna see and thank everybody who did take the time. I'm not necessarily gonna look through individual answers. I might. I might. I don't know. We have time. So we had Gion, Crystal, Hacker, Kobobo, Lemon, Nyx, Wolf, Vengeance, Castifer, Coax, Mac, Giorgio, Caspian. Potato, Batty, Luigi Gamer, Titans, Time, Deacon, Peasons, Biggest Fan, Mads, Ed, Angie Nemo, and Sneaky Jakey. Thank you, everybody. Thank you to these 24 for taking the time to complete this. And thank you, guys. I appreciate it. Okay, so let's do a little deep dive. Do you hold the door open for others? The most common answer, yes, with 45%. Sometimes, but not always, 10, 41%. Now, everything in green was the correct answer, because for some of the multiple choice, like for the door one, yes and sometimes are both good answers. That's still, you're still a good guy. Um, never was one person. Fucking psycho. I like to watch the door slam in their face. Two people. Even worse. It looks like the majority. 86% are good people for that. Do you volunteer? Majority. For no, 18, 75%. 25% volunteer, nice. You probably are in school doing your mandatory volunteering for graduation. Congrats. Like I said earlier, I don't feel comfortable volunteering. Like, I feel like I should be compensated for my time. And especially if it's for, like, a larger um, organization that could theoretically afford to pay all the employees, then why not pay them? Easy. Do you pre-rinse your dishes? 79% said yes. Thank you for being decent human beings. 20% said no. Why don't you pre-rinse your dishes? I can understand if you have a dishwasher, but they don't do all the work sometimes. Okay? If you are eating rice, or, like, something sticky, like honey, or when we did the cake pops, I had to, like, scrape all the white chocolate off the mugs, because once you mix water with chocolate, it's GG's. It's never gonna like melt. So I, I reheated the mugs and I scraped the chocolate off. If you don't pre-rinse, change your behavior, okay? Or ask ask whoever in the house the dishes what they prefer. Do you put your shopping cart in the rack? 91%. I think the largest margin we've seen so far. 91% said yes. One person leaves it in the lot. Where's Giorgio? I think you self-reported earlier. And then one person said, I purposely leave it in the middle of the parking spot. Crazy. Now, there is one chatter I know lied on every single question, because I know, I know this chatter. And I will report them. Self-report, I will, we will look at more specific answers later. <laughs> no way 22 people are being honest. I mean, I feel like, I feel like not many people will put their cart in the wrong spot. I feel like I feel like only old motherfuckers do that. 
to where like, oh, I've spent so much of my life doing this. I can't walk anymore. <laughs> I'm, I'm not gonna put it in the rack. I always see shopping carts in the handicapped spaces and I feel sad. Anyway. In public, do you listen to music with headphones on? 95% said yes. One person said no, and I know which person this is. I know you're not watching right now because of time zones, but I, I fucking know it's you. <laughs> One person lied here. This almost was a 100% answer, and you fucked it up. I hate them. iPad kid, probably. This one was interesting to me. The candy jar question. 50-50. A rare 50-50. A rare one-to-one. -one. I don't know. I just found it interesting. To me, if you take it first, then you're selfish. And if you ask first, then you're selfish, but you're not outwardly selfish. I think that's the main thing. Because common courtesy automatically implies outward perspective of how you conduct yourself. Okay, if you need to cancel plans, do you tell them you cancel, or do you flake? Um... Yeah, 87% tell them you can't go. I think that's fair. I can understand why some people flake. It's just a matter of, like, not being able to communicate that you can't go. And there's a bit of anxiety with that, and I can respect that. Have you ever yelled at a service worker? 95% said no, one person said yes, I'm proud of it. I know which fucker said that, and they're lying. They're literally lying. They're a wee little liar. Yeah, like you said earlier, don't fucking yell at people. It's not nice. You're not a tyrant. Don't yell. This one. All you little Zoomers who are on your phones all day, and your whole life is on your phone? That's a problem. Do you double text? The majority said yes. This one was surprising to me. I understand that the majority of my audience is younger, like teenagers or young adults, but this... Don't double text, please. It... Like I said earlier, it's... The person who's on the receiving end, I just assume they're getting anxious. So don't double text. If they're at work, respect that. If they're at school, respect that. Okay? Okay. Thank you, good eight people. Minority finally... For the good people. I'll probably still double text and that's fine. It takes a while to correct behaviors. Okay, not correct, but change behaviors. Correct is not the right word. I sometimes send five or more. Okay, that's I Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Or like the people who send one word per line. Not to call out Rainy, but she does it. And it's fine, but it scares me. <laughs> it scares me. <laughs> I mean, that's just how some people talk, and that's fine. It's just, I, uh, it freaks me out. Are you gonna put slay? Oh my god. I hate this. Okay, if somebody doesn't reply to your text, do you call them right after? 83% said no. 16% said yes. Oh no. Why do you do this? I think texting... And asking if you can call them is fine. But texting and then calling right after? It's what your parents do, okay? Don't be like your parents. In that way. <laughs> Ay, Dio mio. Have you lied this year? 75% said yes. 16% said maybe. And 8% said no. If you voted no, you're lying. You are lying. Trolling is lying, okay? If you're trying to debate somebody, if you're trying to get somebody got, that's lying. Maybe it's funny. Maybe it's cute. Yeah, those two people are lying. Yeah, exactly. Have you donated to charity? I don't, though. Kappa. Kappa. I saw that was your answer, Potato. No, joking is lying to some capacity. Some people see joking as lying, so it, by definition, is lying. You can't change your answers, though. Have you donated to charity? 25% have, 75% haven't. I assume if you're in that 75, you're like me, where you're broke or you don't have a job or you're in school. But thank you to everybody who has donated. 
Unless you're donating to bad charities that are false charities, then that's bad. Okay, do you follow me on Twitter? 83% said yes. <laughs> no, but I will right now. Did I get a new follower? Ain't no way. <laughs> and then no, I have no interest or no active account. Sad. Minus three followers, guys. But cool. Very nice. Okay, let's see if I can look at individual responses. Because we can highlight a few. Because there were a few that stood out to me. Okay, it's not gonna show anything. Yeah, because, like, I didn't want to put your guys' emails or anything. That's why... Oops. Hold on. There we go. Like, it just... The only thing that would give information would be, like, your, your username. Now, we're gonna self-report. We're gonna report on some people. Some people did not answer correctly. Let's skim... <laughs> I think it's so- I don't know what the results look like after you submit, but I think it's funny. Have you lied this year? Yes, the correct answer is- correct answer is no. <laughs> okay, Crystal is good. Can't wait. Wait, Crystal, you were saying I would take it first. You're lying. Did you answer correctly in the quiz and then falsely in the chat? Kinda cringe. Who got the highest score? I don't know if I can see that. Let's see. Yeah, I don't think I can see who got the highest score. Sad. Sad day. I just said I was hungry, but you implied that was your answer. Okay, this is hackers. Any wrong answers? Do you volunteer? Yeah, not, not, not many people volunteer. I can respect that. They would take the candy first? Rude. Have you lied this year? Yeah. <laughs> okay, hackers good. There were some people that I was very interested in their answers. Koboba would take the candy first? I feel like that was the most commonly answered wrong. Wait, have you? <gasps> Kobobo double text? Oh no. Oh no. Okay, yeah. I mean, none of these are too bad. Like, I didn't put any- I didn't have any questions that were like, actually mean shit. It's just like, common courtesy. Okay. A lot of you guys would take the candy first. That's fine, you're just being selfish. Okay, nobody donates to charity. Noted. Okay, we have Nyx. <gasps> Nyx double text? Uh-oh. Yeah, no, nobody's donated to charity. Nobody's donating. Sad charities. Okay, we have Wolf. <gasps> no. You don't pre-rinse your dishes? That's actual child behavior. Only children don't pre-rinse their dishes. Wolf would take the candy first? Uh-oh. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Okay, we have Vengeance. Vengeance doesn't pre-wash their dishes? It's probably because they want more time to practice Mario Kart, honestly. They would take the candy first, okay. They double text! Oh, that's three, that's three. Red flags everywhere? Yeah, exactly. Some of y'all are... Not as wholesome as I thought you were. We should have done this before the naughty or nice list, honestly. Wait, who is this? Castifer. Castifer would take the candy first. Figures. They double text. <laughs> guys, you guys need to stop with the double texting. Y'all need to seriously stop. Y'all need to stop. Okay, we're about halfway through. Coax. Taking the candy first. Oh, you guys are so greedy. You're so greedy. Okay. Coke's only got one. They only got two wrong. I think Coke's... Oh, wait, three. Never mind. I don't know. Okay, Mac. Mod check Mac. Oh, no. Mac double text. Oh, no. <gasps> 
If someone doesn't reply, do you call them right after? Yes. Oh no. That's like the worst. You were defending yourself earlier in chat. That's the- don't. No. Oh no. I feel like you should have added that joke he's lying. Um, actually. <laughs> no. This is all for fun. We got Georgia. Of course you would take the candy first. Of course. Do you double text? Oh, bro. <gasps> you don't follow me on Twitter? That's rude. The first person who doesn't follow me on Twitter. Kind of cringe, not gonna lie. If you're a real fan, you'd follow me on Twitter. Wait, I gotta change the pin message, actually. Because we're not doing the list anymore. Don't go follow my Twitter. I'm very close to 100 followers. Ain't no way. <laughs> I follow no one. Well, follow me then. Easy. We have Caspian. The first person to answer never. Do you hold the door open for others? Never. Oh my god. That's literally so rude. So rude. They would take the candy first, of course. Figures. Figures. Do you double text? Oh, come on. Everybody's double texting. Everybody stop double texting. It's not cool. Caspian's the biggest troll ever. True. We have potato. Potato double text? You call people right after? No, guys. Stop it. Stop it. Y'all need to stop call texting. Oh my god. We have baddie. Machik baddie. Nobody's volunteering. Literally nobody's volunteering. Oh, they double text. Oh, come on. Come on. Wait, and they put heavy lead this year? Maybe. <laughs> double texting is whack and not in a good way. I agree. I agree. I have call anxiety. Me too. I don't like calling. But don't double text either. It's not that hard. Luigi Gamer. Okay. Where is it? Look, okay. Luigi answered. Have you lied this year? No. You're lying. You have to be lying. You're literally lying. You have to be. Because they answered everything else correctly, except for the volunteer and donating. It was this Titans. They don't volunteer? Cringe. Imagine not volunteering. <laughs> they double text and they call! Oh no. Oh no. Cringe. They deserve to be on the naughty list, not gonna lie. Okay, this is time. They don't volunteer. Valid. They've lied. Okay, good. I feel like not many people donate and everybody lies, so I, those are fine. Those are fine. Valid. I think time is, like, the best. If you have 10 points, I think that's the best you can score. Okay, Deacon. They don't pre-rinse their dishes. Don't like that. And the flake? They double ducked and they go. Oh, dude. So many red flags. I don't like Deacon anymore. They can uh, never come back. Okay, final four. Peason. Okay. I know Peason's biggest fan. They're one of my friends. I wanted them to take this seriously. And I don't think they did. Do you hold the door open for others? I like to watch the door slam in their face. Do you volunteer? No. Do you pre your dishes? No. Do you put the shopping cart in the rack? I purposely place it in the middle of the empty parking spot. In public, do you listen to music without headsets? Yes. Take the candy- Look, they answered everything wrong on purpose. This little shit. 
They flake when they have to cancel. They've yelled- They've literally never yelled at a service worker. Or they've been lying to me this whole time. Do you double text? Yes. Do you call somebody right after? No. Okay, that's the one question they've gotten right so far. Have you lied this year? Maybe. <laughs> and they don't follow me on Twitter. I know they don't follow me on Twitter. Or maybe it's on a secret alt that I don't know they have. They're literally lying. Literally lying! Look, two points! The worst score you've seen today, two points. You have mans? They don't volunteer? They double text, but they don't call. If they don't donate to charity. Okay, that's fine. Pretty solid response. Only five points? Uh-oh. Ed, oh no, Ed. Do you hold the door open for others? I like to watch the slam in the face. Okay, you're trolling, you're trolling. Do you pre-rinse? No, you hate, th you hate people. You're trolling, you're literally trolling. Take the candy first. Flake? Okay, they're answering some answers truthfully. So maybe they're just actually crazy. <laughs> the final two. Angie. They don't volunteer. They double text. <laughs> Have you lied this year? Maybe. That's my favorite. Okay, final response. This was... Snakey Jake. Oh, they actually volunteer? Ain't no way. Ain't no way. They take the candy first. Valid. They double text. <laughs> Maybe I have a line. They don't donate to charity. No, but I will right now. What? No, but I will right now. Ain't no way. Plus one following. Okay. So I think that concludes this year's Naughty or Nice review. We have determined that my chat room begrudgingly loves to double text and sometimes call after said text is not answered. They typically put the cards away and nobody volunteers. All in all, pretty decent. Not too good, but also not too bad chat room. Okay, so. I think that concludes today's main events, but stream is not over yet, guys, because we had two resubs today, so we get to do calligraphy. If you're new to stream, anybody who donates to the channel or uses their channel points will get their name written at the end of stream. So I'm going to go ahead and get that set up. Tomorrow, we will be doing Santa Watch, so we're going to have a, a wide variety of activities that we can do while we wait for Santa. I'm probably going to stream probably starting at like 3 or 4 p.m. Because Santa usually comes to my area at around like 8 or 9 p.m. So crossing my fingers he gets here earlier in the day. But yeah, so I will be streaming in the afternoon tomorrow. Keep in mind it's my time. So if it's 3 p.m. my time, it'd be around 7-ish Eastern. And as always, make sure you follow me on Twitter. That way you get updates about stream. Wowie. So we're going to change our title and set up that second camera. But what did you guys think of today's stream? Was it fun? What did you think of the segments? Thank you for redeeming Lemon. Thank you. 
I know you said earlier it's not often you get to see a full stream, but I'm glad we had you today, Crystal. So tomorrow for activities, no leaks, but there are some things that I need to do. Cause not saying that I procrastinated on my gifts, but I might need to do some prep. So I think tomorrow, I know I need to wrap a few things. I need to probably make a Christmas card. Cause I don't want to buy one cause they're way too overpriced. Um, I may need to finish some of the presents. If you guys want to see a leak. I can go grab it, actually. Because I'm making anime paintings for my friends. You can kind of see the pencil. So I, I've only done the pencil. I've been too tired throughout the week to like actually start painting. So I might paint some on stream tomorrow. We can maybe do some more... Naughty or nice list reviews. Um, what else can we do? We can maybe do some more decor ornament decorating. I want to. Do we have to do Animal Crossing because the Santa Day event is tomorrow. Because we gotta stream for at least four hours tomorrow, because we gotta wait for Santa. Hopefully he'll arrive. I don't want to do anything in the kitchen. I kind of want to stay upstairs in my room. Because I don't want to lug the, the setup up and down the stairs. I was able to get my ethernet cable from downstairs to my room, that's why stream is running a bit better today. Why are you scared? Of what? Huh? Okay, we had Hacker with a 8 month resub. Crazy! Oh, Bakugo is scary? Not really. He's not that bad. Oh, also, I have a treat for everybody who watches tomorrow's stream. So make sure you're here tomorrow. Should I leak what it is, or do you guys want it to be a surprise? Granted, it's nothing crazy. It's nothing crazy. Do you want me to leak? Oh, I think I should keep it a surprise. I don't know, I'll think about it. Surprise? I think I'll tell you guys tomorrow. So make sure you show up for tomorrow's stream. Even if you just say hi, you'll still get a little treat. Thank you for redeeming Mac. Yeah, I think the way we did the, um, what you call it, the Naughty or Nice quiz would, was a lot better than like pre-filming a bit. I feel like it was better because more people could do it, so it probably made more fe people feel engaged. Because I think getting even five people to agree to film a bit and like edit it down, I don't think you could have done it in time. 
Okay. So once again, thank you, Hacker, and Rainy for the resubs today. I'll post this later on Twitter if I remember. I'm surprised I only got through like 30-ish of the Naughty or Nice segment. I thought I'd get through more, but I did not realize how long it would take. Because I was trying to like skim through the logs, but also like commentate. I, th I thought I would get through like at least 50. Because like I could stream longer today, but I kind of need a break. Isn't the snaps so nice? <laughs> yeah, Lemon got it because I don't think anybody redeemed it right away. Okay, this is gonna be the last name of the day, so if you want me to write your name, all I gotta do is use your channel points or donate to the channel. Last call. Last call. end it here i would like to thank everybody for watching any chatters lurkers i hope you guys enjoyed today's stream i know it was a long awaited one and i hope it was up to everyone's expectations it was really fun <laughs> um i will be live again tomorrow at probably like 3 or 4 p.m my time so at around like 6 or 7 eastern with a Santa watch stream, we're gonna be waiting for Santa and doing a load loads of activities. <laughs> um, so yeah, I had fun today. I will see you guys tomorrow. Yeah, we're glad to have you back, Crystal. Anyway, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Okay, bye. That was crazy. I, genu I genuinely thought we'd get through more of the naughty or nice list. But it, whew, it was a lot. Okay, I'll see you guys tomorrow. You guys have a good rest of your day. Dude, it's 3 p.m.? How? That's crazy. Okay. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Okay, bye-bye. <laughs>